Hi everyone. How you doing? We are gonna be playing some Forza. What's up, be my enemy? Me. Hope everyone is happy and well today. And me. Alright, so we have, we have the following things to do, we have reach 140 miles an hour in any Horizon Story chapter, we have um, beat any rival ghost, and all that stuff that needs to be done in a couple of days. We've got all this done and we need to do that trailblazer and this eliminator. So I'm going to start Welcome off with the eliminator. So as you guys know, it is Saturday. And we are going to be playing some Forza because it is our weekend game that we do with the community. No, I am not. I have been live for two minutes and it has been since six o'clock. So, no, no. Oh, and we need to do this. I am a punctual dinosaur. Hello, Minnie. Arr. What do you want? Arr. Can you go do my cup of tea, please? Arr. Stop making weird noises. It's a pillager. It's a villager. I don't, no. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. I never got lost. Yeah. What? What? He wasn't even there. What are you on about, mate? You DM'd me, yes? Uh, let's have a look. Uh, so, sorry, sweetie, no, that, but you just had to. What one is it that's being discontinued? Turn around when it is safe to do so. No, Minnie's trying to be uh, a um, a thing, apparently. Who's him? Of course I'm losing. He's faster than I am. How much do this? Yeah, link me, sweetie. Have you lost? In 400 yards, turn sharp left. Yeah, you screwed me over, mate. You lose. Are you lost? Okay, 
I got screwed over there. Are you starting again? Oh, that one. You showed me that one, yeah. I mean, we can't afford it, sweetie, to be honest. Because we've got Arceus to pay for. Buy free, get one free. Use code B3G1. Right. When does it get... When does it... When is it gone by? Hi, Scorp. You're not really sneaking in, buddy. I saw you. When it's gone, well, we, hey, we can't afford it this week. I mean, the earliest we could afford it would be the 19th, you know? I mean, ask them. Ask them if you can. Yes, the clap of your ass cheeks alerted the guards. It set off the alarms. <laughs> if you can message them, sweetie, and find out... Because, or, or ask them if they could put one on hold. Yeah, or something. And that's the only thing I can say, you know? Any certainty. Oh, okay. Well, then I'm sorry. It may look like you won't be able to get it. Mean. Yeah, because we have um, we have um, Pokemon coming out, and I want to get that for us both so I can make content on it and you can play it. Um, um, just because Klarna works for you, sweetie, doesn't mean that it, we can afford it, you know? Because you still have to make a, a chunk payment on that. And you also have one, exi uh, one that you already have. You know? I can't find a car. A car? Oh. I am so screwed at this point. Anyone what? sees me, I'm done. They've got me.
No, I get that. And dude. Where is Oh man, I am so screwed. Go away. Go away. Nope, not, there's not one there. All right, we're going to do that. No way! <sighs> nah, mate, there's that. Honestly, they're, they're doing something. Because every single one of those smokes, I can't activate them. You know, I can't activate them. It won't let me. In 100 yards, turn sharp left. Fuck them. Yeah, you saw me drive through them, right? Yeah. I couldn't do fuck all. I was driving through them and I couldn't get anything out of them. Yeah. That was bullshit, mate. <laughs> that was absolute bullshit. That was absolute bullshit.
Pick livery gift. New car. Unique players. Hi. All right, um, send us a gift. Anyone? There you go. Name a tag. Um, gift is being sent. Okay. I'm all right. Anyone? I'm just copying you a lot of victories. Name a tag. Bam. Turn that off. Hi, swing. Oh, look, a hurricane. I haven't got that one. Oh, gift car. Oh, I need to go, 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 get a bar. How am I doing? Um, I'm all right, to be fair. I feel like I'm doing okay. Got lots to do. But it is what it is, you know. Marathon. You know. Right, um... Our collection. Our, look, Lamborghini Hurricane. There we go. Two more Lambos, and then I've got the thingy. It's a three million one. Five million. Two hundred eighty thousand. You were playing a game last night. What game was you playing, mate? Ah, uh, yeah, I know. I've heard of it. Hi, sweetie. Mute a minute. Yeah, guys, give me a second. I need to mute a moment. New supporter acquired. Status change from neutral to friendly.
Wow, that's generous. Well, just the spirit of Horizon, isn't it? Shall we send a thank you? Sorry, I was having a conversation with my partner. Uh, I am back now. Hi. Hi, hi Wolfie and um, Sh Shulker. Um, I have all sorts of different cars. I don't really try and make the bestest of best cars. It's all about having fun for me. I like to play the game. So the best car is the car I'm having, in the, mo having the most fun in. And as, as I play this with my community a lot, and all that really matters to me. I don't play this game competitively. Nice one, dude. Does that answer your question there, pal? Oh, what about you, dude? Do you play this game? Do you have like a, a best car? Do you like to drive all the time? I mean, I like to drive all sorts of cars and depending on, on what type of racing we're doing or events, I do have like go-to cars that I like to drive. Oh, that's not the way I needed to go. Of all the ways to get up here, there is all the bumps there what about you there are you sh uh, I have no idea. I'm just checking it now. No, I bloody didn't, did I? You gotta do it with 25 seconds, and because of that bump right at the end, I just it just screwed me. I was doing really good all the way to the end. Ow. 
yeah, that's that's a big fail right there. I lost a lot of speed doing that. We'll try it again. Right, here we go. Round the corner. How are you feeling today, Ghost? Are you feeling a little bit better now, mate? Oh. Yeah, I had to have a sleep a bit. No. I rolled it there. No. Yeah, how you doing, Scorp? You haven't been around in a while, so... We haven't spoke. Last time we spoke, you said you was sorting out getting ready to play your um your skylanders games again No worries, dude. Glad I can give um, some helpful hints and tips, you know? I mean, you, the best thing to be aware of, um, Zen, is it ain't like um, Twitch. You don't need to have, like, fancy animated borders around cameras and stuff over here, you know? Because it's more about the production quality more than the visual fanciness. No, that's cost me. Nice. You're going to be at work on Monday? Awesome, dude. So happy for you. I recorded a new video today and I need to just do some editing, do some voiceover, and then I can have that ready to go out live when the embargo lifts. That cost me there. Didn't need as much of a tweak there. Come on. How's everyone else doing? What you done today? I was so lazy today, I didn't get up till con midday. Mind you, I was up till gone three o'clock, I watched the new Ghostbusters movie. That Ghostbusters Afterlife? 
Oh, bad. fast enough. I'm not fast enough. Oh. How's that? Time. Five Fridays on. Uh. Wow. New supporter acquired. Status change for oh, thank you for the subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. Right. Put that on there. Yeah, I went to the right hand side of the hill. Yeah, I, I'm trying to get to the right hand side. And give it maximum grunt, you know. Oh, I'll do that. I'll have to do. I appreciate that, mate. Oh, I know what I forgot to do. Um, no. How are you doing today, mate? Uh, so I need to order around the camera. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, mate, it's one of those. Like, um, if you if you feel like um, if you if you feel like you can reduce stuff, like you don't need the pop up for like um, Twitch, obviously, because you're moving over to here, aren't you? So you can you can drop stuff like that and then you can just clean it up. It's just a case of it's minimalistic, you know? That's all you gotta be aware of, you know? I don't do any more to it. Let's give it a rally diff. Yeah. 
Give it a rally diff. I'm, I'm all right, Scorp. Trying to just do the best I can, you know? I'll go with that. That, that seems like a, a good idea. Quickly for our paint job on it because the paint job just irks me. Ugh. Irks, not jerks. No. Oh my god, some of you are so bad. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> the sticker just has a sign on it, Trump won. What the fuck? Why get political in computer games? Oh, it's got He-Man on it, that'll do. I mean, I'm trying, mate. I'm trying to get... I'm trying to be, be good, you know? Trying to be the best I can be, you know? But as always, thank you to everyone who has hit the like button and thank you to the two new subscribers. You guys are amazing. Hello? Hello, Toasty Boy. <laughs> ah, you're good. What? Wait, what? You brought it back from the dead? Oh, oh, I don't know. You had to undervolt it. Wow. Wow, you really had to like do some heavy undervolting. Well, that's good. I didn't even get to see your stream this morning, mate. I was out cold. I was sick till midday. Yeah. Okay. Oh, what, what happened? Oh, gross. Oh, you're welcome. No, no, uh, YouTube shorts, you talk. Terrible. It wasn't funny the fifth time either, was it? No, it wasn't. Oh, cock! Oh.
I am just having no luck today trying to do this one. I know, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to do the Trailblazer again and get that done. Nice. That's what I spent most. What I spent most of the bloody day doing. Ah, uh, god damn it. Oh, I've just lost all that extra time. No, I don't know. I didn't. I went so sad. Hi Toys, how you doing man? Right, I'm getting some good speed here. Oh poo! Freaking done it. Hey, hey, toys, how you doing? Yeah. Yeah, I know. I know. Hey, toys, how you doing? All right, if anyone wants to come and play, you're more than welcome. I just got the rest of the, the festival done now. Look at all that. All that shininess. <laughs> nice. If anyone does want to come play, you're more than welcome. All we've got to do is follow the rules that we use. And you're more than welcome. Be a subscriber of the channel. Send me a message and we'll get you in. Um... Uh, what is my favorite car? The NT just sent me a message on Xbox asking me what is my no, I'm not playing the crew too. I play good games. Gosh, you know that. I mean, I mean, Josh should come and play a decent game. You should come and play. You should come and play Forza with us. I did. <laughs> I knew the crew too was coming from you. <laughs> Do, do, do you know what? I, I can tell you right now, since new name is Crew Wadge. You're at Crew Wadge. I'm trying to think, what is my favorite car on Forza Horizon 5? Um, oh, I've always liked the X Class. I mean, I do. I do like the X Class. Um,. I do like things that you can throw the back end and slide it around the corner. Um, and he did the Bertie designs. Is the, you mean, hold on, hold on, I know what one you're talking about. You're talking about this magical car that you love so much. Let me just get to it. It's this one. It's, where is it? The, the, the BM <laughs> You uninstalled Forza? Really? How come, dude? Look, mate. Look, I have every other everything I hate about this car is its design. Okay, 
it has a nice engine it has a nice everything else but it's fucking ugly I mean, no, what you do is you just rip all the panels off and have, a re have it rebodied to look like a decent car. <laughs> Mate, oh, yeah, like, oh, honestly, the, uh, the, the internal machinations of the i8 with, um, oh, what one? What one is it? It's, um, I'd love to see this slammed on top of it just to wind up guns that throw throw the body of that on an i8 just to what yeah just to wind guns up you know you know i want to move it from ssd to major oh no yeah, I like, I like, I'll, sh I'll show you, I'll show you one of my cars that I like to drive. Um, I hate this three wheel cars. Get out. There you go. Look at this. Look at this. Can anyone guess what this is? Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a slow pan around, okay? And you have to guess. Ready? Really, it's Herbie. You fucking troll. <laughs> oh. Hero from TC two? No. Shut up, Phoenix. You know what it's supposed to be. Exactly, Quinn. Exactly. It's an Optimus Prime paint job. I mean, if they put this in your in Euro Truck Sim like this, it'd be pretty cool. I mean, maybe. Um, is it, is it, so it's actually the character hero. Okay, I got a car that that might um be um a car that 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 Sid might like. Where is it? Um, what one? Yeah, it's because it's got fifteen brake or fifteen hundred brake horsepower, mate. Yeah, it's like a stonking fat big engine on the on the front end on the back end. There you go. This is the one that um this is the one that Sid might like. Oh uh Oh, uh, we've we've already got we've already got the the ultimate sleeper car in this game. Hold on, uh, the ultimate sleeper car is um, it's where is it? Um, yeah, that. I think mine's just, that's an ultimate sleeper car there. A five turbo um and this uh, the civic rs that's the sleep why is it so thick mate, mate, mate there you go ready 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 sid ready you're like my anime weeb yeah is my anime is my anime weeb showing <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this thing isn't slow by any means. Why is it so thick? Because it's got a thick booty. It, it is definitely harem worthy, isn't it?
<laughs> this thing is a thing of beauty. Right, so who needs to do any of the Forza Festival? Okay, let's get you in. Oh, damn. Oh god. I mean, why don't you just use xCloud? You're not, you're not streaming, so why don't you just use xCloud? Yeah, I know, but you're, but you're not streaming right now. So you could just jump onto the xCloud and remote in via the website, you know? YouTube gamers, so <laughs> long enough for you for your mom. Dude, I could do better. Anything I could do better than you. Not. Yes. I ate it. I got hungry and I chewed up your controller. I'm sorry, dinosaur has needs. I needed a new chew toy and I couldn't find it to find my chew toy. <laughs> chew up controller. <laughs> it's it is. <laughs> you can do, I can do better. Yeah, that is definitely a harem car. Um, hold on, let me show you another one. This one not might be up your street, Sid. Um, um, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I mean, if, if I'm going to roar, it's going to be one of these. I've got to get you when you least expect it, buddy. You know I do. Really? It's not pulling. It's done out of love. Yep. Do you, do you like this one then, Sid? Uh. No, it's Harim. It's, it's Harim. It's where it's Harim, isn't it? I mean, that's, that's how they pronounce it in all the different, like, etchies. Uh, I don't know, but that'll be interesting. I mean, if you if you if you're doing it off of the X Cloud, it's not running off of your system. It's running off of um. I mean, I I I, I wouldn't. You want to risk blowing up your PC? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> Any uh, 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 any form of uh, any form of Adobe, you open up. You're like, oh god, oh god, oh god, it's gonna crash! It's gonna crash! Please don't crash! Please don't crash! <laughs> <laughs> I 
Wait, right, you coming in then, Zen? Oh, well, we're gonna race the train. Okay. I mean, you're, you're hardly on much as it is, mate, to be fair. Work has you run ragged. Right, I'm just, I'm just saying, I've watched enough Etchy to know that they pronounce it Harim in, in the, uh, in the Etchies. So that's, I mean, if it's Harem or Harim, I'm just going off of what the animes call it, you know? I know it, I, I know it's pronounced a Harem in, like, when you're talking about it in, in, like, the proper things, but, but I, I like to, to refer to it in the way that the, the cringiness of the, the etchies. It's no, no, no. It's it's a harem. It's a harem of 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 women. What what kind kind of what? Oh, what one did you have? Oh, right. Do you have a do you have a machine in your house where you can like crush up ice? Look at that. Damn. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I know. I don't. I don't doubt that. I don't doubt that, Sid. I know it's pronounced harem, but but that's the whole thing. In the etchies, which is the correct term for harem-based anime. They refer to them as harems, and I find it hilarious. So I do it on purpose. Yeah. 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 Every every flavor gets better with ice. Honestly. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we, 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 so we're talking about uh, a, a building where you, you, you house your ladies that wear the, the scantily clad clothes and have the, the curves in the right areas in, in, in like Middle Eastern Prince of Persia type environments, especially in the Prince of Persia movie when he jumps into the harem. But in the Echi, as in like the Japanese manga and anime, they always pronounce it as Harim, which is hilarious. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's weird. Yeah, it could be. Yeah. Yeah. That sucks if you can't. Yeah. But you gotta understand it's all natural. Maybe. Hey, <clears throat> the harem I'm talking about is is it yeah, it's definitely it's definitely not um it's definitely not religious. It's um I mean it's it's a temple of the flesh, that's what it is. Right, you got to come in on the far right side. You've got to go very far right to come in from a smoother angle. Otherwise, you're hitting all the bumps and it takes all your time away. I mean, like, you're almost going away from it for a bit and then come cutting in. Kind of. Yeah, like... So I'll, I'll show you on the stream.
Yeah. Yeah, you want to come? Here, here, here you go, Zen. I'm just going to drive it normal, okay? Yeah, come, come down here. Yeah. And when you come down, come over this way. Obviously, don't go down this this far like a an angle because of all, obviously all the bumps. But if you come down the hill smoothly. You can come down around these heather patches following down there and then you go down this way you got the first heather patch on your right here obviously there's rocks here but you got to dodge those not hard obviously i'm not doing it the right way because i'm throwing my car about you come along here There's the, there's the heather patches. There. See them. And you want to you want to keep the you want to keep the trailblazer sign on your right. Watch out for that rock. Obviously. I I honestly you say sticking as far right you can is good because if you're this far right. It's all nice and smooth, yeah? Keep going straight. And head towards this. This little green field. And then past this rock here. And then you can come down. And then it's just a, a swish up here. How much how much cleaner it is no 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 more humbug crim because it's like not christmas can't be humbugging mate yeah well there you go direct route yeah Yeah, you could have done that as well. Nice one, dude. No, you can't be all humbuggy, mate, because humbug, our humbug is all about Christmas. You know? And it's not Christmas no more. There you go, there's your invite. Okay. Okay, pal. What are you having for dinner? Ew, why, why must you peas with lasagna? No, you have garlic bread or salad with lasagna. I mean... Yeah, obviously, cheesy garlic bread. But not mushy peas. <laughs> that's like... That, that's, that's like a meeting of the different regions. The mushy peas is the most English thing you can... Yeah, <laughs> like put ketchup on a roast dinner. No, no, right. You know what I mean? When I say it's the most English thing you could do to a, a, a meal. No, you, 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 you can. Oh, the humbugs. You're talking about the sweets. Oh, I love humbug. Mint humbugs are delicious.
Oh, mate, I do a bacon wrap lasagna. <laughs> bacon wrap lasagna is delicious because you literally cut into it like it's like cutting a loaf of bread. Flying of <laughs> Bloody hell, did you just see that? Nice. Oh God, that's insane. On three thousand on an eye pace. Hold on. How the hell did you get three thousand meters in an eye pace? Yeah, that is bull crap. Hold on. Hold on. How can how can a D class get forty three thousand meter feet? I'm sorry, but you can't do forty two thousand feet. That is a clearly a glitch. Yeah, pretty much, Krim. That, I mean, like, that's insane. Why? That uh, doesn't annoy me at all. This is clearly this is all glitched here. Nah, mate. I'm in the top one million, top two million. But then again, what? You're a glitch. Maybe. I mean, I mean, I, I don't, I don't think that's too bad considering that I haven't used an Avija. I mean, a, a Jesco. I'm pretty sure I could do better though. I want to see if I can. <laughs> Yeah, I know, right? Gosh, it's insane. I don't see why people do it, mate. I don't I I don't get why people cheat games like that, you know? Yeah.
It just sounds a bit hanky, if you ask me. Oh, okay. Why is that one a hell of a lot shorter? I, I don't get how that one was shorter. Is there like a specific point to hit the bridge that gives you the maximum air? Do you have an Avija? Get an Avija and literally just crank it all the way to speed. Let's see if I could get my Avija to go faster. I've got two of them now. Lotus. Wow, that's that's terrible. That that just ruins the game. Why do that though? <coughs> This is insane. This is faster than what I had it before. Okay, this this is it. This is this is the this is the last time I'm gonna do this. Hey, new personal best. I'm happy with that. Yes, the closer to vengeance. That, that, that's that's what I'm happy about. I'm getting closer to vengeance. You know, I'm pretty. I'm pretty sure that if I was to tinker with this car, you know. Yeah, I know it's dumb. It's dumb when people cheat cheat leaderboards. That's why I don't care about them. Um, we are going to be doing the festival stuff to help um, Ghost because he hasn't done them yet. Okay, mate. <laughs> Off road. Oh. Uh... No, you got your your free um thingy thingy though, haven't you? You got your token.
Oh, okay. Well, then you just need to do the um, thing that unlocks the Avija, which is to do with the arcades. Okay. You only have 1.1 mil? Oh. That's a land on Hala. Just crank it to there. <laughs> you sure? Why did why do you have a PlayStation 4 that's on the floor? Well that's not good. 28.64 Good your jo your I thought you was coming to join us on this. Oh, come on, dude. Yeah, he's blowing us out, isn't he? He's like, he doesn't love us anymore. <laughs> he doesn't love us anymore. <sighs> <laughs> See how it is? I mean, <clears throat> I see how it is. <laughs> yeah, it's no love anymore. Wow. I mean, Solzy could come and hang out with us. Let's see how it is. Uh, yeah. I can, yeah. yeah. I'd sooner shoot myself in the face with a BB gun than hang out with that kid. Yeah, I know, right? So unloved! <laughs> <laughs> They're bad again, us. <laughs> yeah, what do you want though? <laughs> yeah, for now. <laughs> You'll leave us eventually. <laughs> right, you ready? What? Yeah, exactly. We should keep him here for as long as possible. We should. <laughs> 57 laps, yeah? <laughs> oh my god, I just did 2400 feet off of that jump. Oh, Luke beat me by first 14 feet. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, but here's the thing, here's the thing. What did he do it in? If it's a Jesco, I'm not gonna I'm gonna be okay with that. Here you go, look, Jesco, 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 Jesco. That eye pace is clearly glitched. I want an eye I want that eye pace. <laughs> The, the, that that A class I pace clearly has something 
pinky about it. Oh, what happened, Krim? Oh, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> On the speed glitch? 530 white? Why, what, what was you planning to do, bud? Explain. <clears throat> Hold on, I'm, I'm just trying one thing. I just want to see, okay? This is for science. Right. What? Hey, it does one thirty. How can this be? Crew two, Ubisoft Ivory Tower better than Forza Horrible Stinky Bad. But, but Sid, Sid, I I love you, buddy. But get get give it. Given the fact that not you you have played both Forza and and the crew, and this game has better graphics, better engines, better content, better financial backing. Uh, it has crossplay. Sounds just like Sony saltiness right there. Right, here we go. No, 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 you can. Now you can pick a car. This this has better end game. I'm sorry, I disagree with the end game. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. How can you say that the crew has better end game than this? The crew too. They are just recycling the same stuff already. I mean, let's let's be honest. Let's t let's take Forza Horizon Four for example. Forza Horizon Four had an extended life cycle, and yet they were still able to come up with new content each week. Whereas the crew too, how many times did they recycle the same content for you guys? I'm not, I'm not a fanboy at all because I like playing the crew too and I like playing Forza but I just think Forza's a better game and it's not because Ivory Tower are to blame it's, it's Ubisoft are to blame Ubisoft aren't prepared to, to invest in Ivory Tower and that's a shame You've got over 450 cars in 80 hours. It takes a bit longer than that in the crew too. I mean, it does, yes. You've got the summit and seasonal. 
You, you're trying to say that the summit is better than seasonal content? We get rotating content every every season. New content every week. We get new content every month. You know? I, I disagree. I mean, I'm looking at data only here. Given the fact that there are more players on Forza than there are on the crew's entire lifespan kind of shows that the crew is not better than in Forza. The Summit is a lot more competitive if you like to play a game that doesn't have a good um, engine and it encourages people to cut 90% of the actual races out. You know? Because I've I've watched I've watched the summit stuff that Sid does, and based on a purely observer perspective, the point the the whole point of the summit is you need to have played the game enough to know every single cut point in the track so you can cut ninety percent of it out, right? I mean, to be fair, anyone, if anyone had got their hands on Ivory Tower, it would be million, it would be miles ahead of where they are now. You know? I mean, I, d I disagree. I disagree, Josh. I, I think that the fact that we have, a we have the competitive opens and we have an actual ranked tournaments that go on for forza on a regular basis like the forza the forza esports competitive community and they've been going since motorsport days and they're actually involved in the horizon as well and they have the horizon competitive uh, leagues that is competitive af you know to the point where my head mod used to be involved in the competitive side of Forza and was ranked in the top 1,000 in the world. You know? So... I, it kind of... It's, it's kind of your perspective. Yes, mate, go on. Yeah. NTA. Yeah. No. What? As in me seek spot. Oh, okay. I don't see an issue with it at all. Society would be two de decades ahead if I were to. <laughs> Sid, how could how could how could how does Ivory Tower being bought by Epic uh, propel society as a whole ahead by two decades? Explain that one for me. I, I I I love the conversation with Josh and Sid when it comes to the crew. Um.
So, okay, so the crew two. Okay, so I'm looking at I'm looking at the the play tracker. Okay, the crew two on this is based off of Steam alone. Um, it has three thousand people playing it. In the last 30 days. How many people are playing Forza Horizon 5? 10 million. Just. Just, just, just want a, 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 just a, a verification here. What's a bigger number, guys? 10 million. Or three thousand. Just, just curious. How many pe? What, what, di what dictates what a, whether a game is a success or not? Right, the amount of people playing it. Correct. Yeah. So let's just say let, let's just let's just give let's just give the crew to an average. How many people will be playing it on PlayStation? I'd say considering that the, the all the PlayStation player players that are like car games can't play Forza, so so they'll probably play they'll probably be playing I'd say about three thousand as well, give or take. Yeah, so that would be three, another three thousand. So we're saying six thousand. And how many crew two players would there be on Xbox? Given the fact that they can all play Forza all free if they have Game Pass, and there are over thirty million people playing Game Pass each month. Hmm. I'm gonna go and say about a hundred. Okay. Okay, okay, just, 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 uh, okay, I'll give it a thousand just to be nice. Okay. There is no cross play with the crew. So, so we'll be nice, we'll be nice, and we'll say that there are a thousand people playing on Xbox. So that's what, 7,000 people playing the crew too. Yeah? Against 10 million hmm okay the official ratio of players is 110 on playstation 4 40 on pc 21 on xbox and one on stadia <laughs> using 3000 for pc is i'll calculate it on a sec but let's just let's just say let's just say about there's about 10,000 people playing. Let's just be generous and say there's about 10,000 people that are playing the crew too. Yeah. So if we go off of that basis and there are 10 million playing Orza, Um, I don't know where you guys went to school or college or university or if you've got this calculus or or have any issues knowing which number is bigger but I'll, I'll, I'll guide you through this one 10 million is a bigger number than 10,000 so by by the the general rules rules of like how uh, whether a game is a, is a success by its player base and how many people continue to play yeah would you would we would we be safe to say that the crew too is being poorly managed by Ubisoft. It is it is one hundred percent down. It is the, the the lack of player base on the crew two comes squarely down at the feet of Ubisoft. And it 
it is, it is a sad state of affairs and i i am with with josh on on i mean i'm with sid on this one if epic were to buy ivory tower the game would be in a better state of affairs wouldn't you agree uh, hold on hold on the crew the crew tools has a, has a 60 fps cap so it's limited to to um 60 fps it can't go higher <laughs> wait wait i can do 120 on it on my on my xbox <laughs> wow <laughs> Wow, why is it limited? I mean, I think it could it could be down to the, the engine or something that but again that is something that that Ubisoft could help them correct, you know but We are we are we are we are being respectful Quinn um, for those who don't know Josh and Sid are good friends of mine and Josh and Sid are big a big big crew fans and they love their crew and, and whenever i'm playing forza the boys like to come in and and give the the bants and say that the crew two is better than forza because why the hell not you know i mean to be fair yeah you know so he, here's my question okay right the crew of two all things calculated the crew two would be on twelve thousand nine hundred right now, and was it? I mean, if if that is if that is the maths that you're pulling out, mate, I, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna look at playercounter.com because I like player counter. Player counter says right now that the the that Forza has um. One million and fourteen thousand fourteen thousand nine hundred and nine players on at right now. That's just based off of their numbers, you know. Uh, live play account. The crew two. Let's see if we can find one for the crew two. The crew two live play account. Um. Oh, PlayStation! I forgot PlayStation Tracker. Forgot about PlayStation Tracker. Where's the photo on that? Oh, it doesn't even come into the top 100. Oh, that means that it's got less than a thousand people playing it. Oh, no, no, because the top one hundred, the top one hundred uh, tracker tracks the the top one hundred games, and it's not even on there. And the top one hundred games in the last seven days. Oh, the crew too. There you go. In the last seven days, it's now sat with seven hundred and thirteen people on the PlayStation. Not bad. That's not bad. Yeah, but I still, I, I still blame the, I still blame Ubisoft for the, for the, 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 the poor numbers. You know, because if if Ubisoft weren't, uh, weren't in control of it, someone at um, any other company who bought it would go. Um, Here's a PS5 port and Series X port of the Crew 2. That would immediately increase number play, uh, player base. Wouldn't you agree, Sid? Good friends. Oh, I see how I see how it is, Sid. Is it time for you to take the puppet off your arm now, Josh? I mean, it's not bad, though, right? I mean, yes. Given the crew to cross platform, give give the crew to cross platform. Give it a, a ninth gen update so it can run at a higher frame rate, and it will do better. You know. I 
mean, it, it would it would just play better. It would just play better, you know. And if a game plays better, people will stay more interested. You know, which is a sad thing, you know. The crew feel will be so similar to the crew too. They can't give us the next. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, terrible. Poor Josh. Oh. So, for those who don't know, um, Sid, Sid is a, a massive crew fan. Like, to the point where, for Halloween, he dressed up as one of, one of the characters from the game. You know? Was that, a, was that, was that a, like a, oh, that's a bit sad kind of thing. I, I sounded, it sounded, it sounded like that was an R of, of pity. Was that, was that an, a pity R? It was a pity R, wasn't it? Uh, just just so just so you know sid um one of the people in my discord call just gave you a pity r for dressing up as hero i mean but it isn't your job just to play one game though is it bud i mean you don't have to play just the crew two do you I was, I, was about to, I was about to say he's so totally the crew's biggest fan, isn't he, Josh? I can tell you right now, Josh. I, I, I have a theory. Want to hear my theory? Yeah, what? No, I, my, my theory is that the 700 people that are playing the crew 2 is all just Sid. He has 700 PlayStation 4s set up and they're all just sat there loaded into the game doing circles. <laughs> Where are you? Uh, yeah, they do float sometimes, bud. Yeah, they do float sometimes. I can't find you. Yeah, I know. Do, do you know what that's? Do you know what that's called? <laughs> NTEs in a DLC car. NTE, do you have a, a do you have a broken car? I'm at the airstrip, yeah. Um what? You mean over here? Right, you need to you need to like tell me where. Yeah. I see you. I see you. You're you're at the, you're at the, you're at the temple, you know that, right? That's called the temple. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The 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 arms are floating. Yeah, it's proper broke. The reason why that is, is it's deliberately done like that because there was an issue with clearance for some of the other vehicles and it was getting people stuck and launching them under the map. I mean, I, 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 have, a, I have a question for you, Sid. 
So is it down to you solely, single-handedly keeping the crew alive? Is it your job to keep the crew alive? <laughs> I mean, I, I don't, I don't see how that is proof to the, say that the crew is better than the crew is better. Because there was a, there was an issue with clearance of on a car that was added, and to fix it within 24 hours, they had it fixed. So they hide, they raised the height of the thing. How is that? How is that sign that the crew too is better? <laughs> hey James, how you doing, mate? I mean, <laughs> Ghost, do you want to type that in chat for me? Just type that in chat for me, that's hilarious. I want to say also, yes, the biggest crate and crew do, Black Panther only touches the game once a month. I'm the only person that consistently made. I mean, to be fair, is it? I mean, if, if, the, if Ubisoft are paying you to keep the game alive, then I, I respect that, but... If they ain't giving you a subsidy check for keeping the game's content flowing on the internet just to keep the, the franchise alive, then I'd, I'd give up. I'd, t I'd go into, the, I'd walk up to the to the life support machine of the crew too, and I'd pull the plug. It's do not resuscitate time, mate. <laughs> He's dead. <laughs> I mean, that's awesome. That is honestly awesome. But it makes me sad because Ubisoft is the biggest problem with this game with, with the crew too. They have neglected the crap out of it and they have cut the budget for, for Ivory Tower so freaking much that they can't even fix the problems with the game. I'm sorry, Need for Speed hasn't been good for a long time, let's be honest. I mean, that does, but that is not, not like a good thing. It's run by EA. <laughs> Letter of Two Evils. No, I would never want I, I I would never want that to happen. I don't like clowns. <laughs> I mean Yeah, that is that is the sad that is the sad thing, Sid. The need for speed was good at one point. And then, then EA got their hands on it and ruined it. They were like, oh, well, here, let's just put some bean counters on this one. And cut budgets. Cut, 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 There you go. There's your game. And there's 77 DLCs to go with it to actually give you the full game. You know? That is the biggest problem with the gaming industry. Letting bean counters get involved and cut our games up. Here you go, it's DLC for the rest of your game. That you paid £60 for. And we took 40% of it away and put it behind a DLC paywall. Sorry, bud. What? 
mean, you, you can write it and do it. Yeah, I saw it. Yeah, he mounted you try to make babies with your car. But what would a what would a Bronco and a, a Warthog's babies look like? You know? Uh, so here's my question for you so here, here's my big question for you sid what are you gonna do if if your if the crew 2 content stops working out for you mate if 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 say for example um let's just say if they say for example uh in june yeah the the viewership for the crew two just just disappears would you rebuild your channel by playing something new or ask your community what they want you to play or would you just like start again and start making content for a new game because as a as a content creator who doesn't just like play one game i'm curious because i've seen content creators i know content creators who play nothing but one game for example i've got a couple of friends whose sole content is fortnite yeah they play nothing but fortnite fortnite every day that is all they do it's either save the world or battle royale save the world or battle royale that is Yeah. Oh. You you I want him to play Roblox, really? Would you start playing Roblox, Sid? <laughs> you are savage tonight, Wolfie. <laughs> you are straight up savage today. I love it. I know I love it. It's making me smile. Keep on being savage. I love it. That brutal honesty is is something we love around here. You know. I guess just the content that I do that doesn't. Uh, require the crew to like reddit higher or lower try out other games what games would you try out though if you if you don't mind me asking he's played forza that's the that's the thing phoenix he's tried forza and with his kim i mean i know he should try it again and play it with us he should come and play it with us he'd have a lot of fun playing it with us you know? I mean, Sid even said that he would do a, do, do a bit of gaming with me on Forza, but never did. You know? Just like he said he was going to take me out on, a, on the town and wine and dine me. He said he's going to take me, take me out for a meal and then a movie. And it never happened. Empty promises. Broke my heart. Racing games, I guess, because that's the only thing that can entertain viewership. Uh, I mean, yeah, I mean, do you, do you, do you have any... Sorry, I got, I got stuck there. <laughs> um, do you have any... Um, do you have any other racing games that you have your eye on? Would you... Hold on, would you give... Um, would you give iRacing a go? And get yourself, like, a big sim racer and do that sort of stuff?
I know a guy that does um, the eye racing stuff and has a sim racer. I mean, have you seen how expensive those sim racing setups are, though? Three grand entry level. Entry level. And, and you know what that three grand is like for the motor, the steering wheel, and the pedals, and a seat. And then if you want to get like really fancy and like have um, the the servo things that like tilt the tilt your rig and stuff like that, you're looking at another seven grand on top. Entry level seven grand. On top of the three grand you've already spent, so that's a full ten grand. It's like 1,500 quid for all the content in the game, is it? I, I don't know. I mean, like, I mean, that, that genre, you know how we was talking about, um, like, I set -o, or is it a set -o, is there a set -o, sorry, a set -o. That's all, like, that's in the, the, the like, I race in the Sims style, isn't it? That's in that same genre. Do you know, I'd actually honestly like to see Sid play a Seto Corsa. Oh. Um, I'll probably just switch to most of streaming and play whatever I'm playing at the time anyway. You and I, I understand that, Sid. It's nice to know how, where, like, what you do as a as a as a plan because, like, I know that you do. I know that you can, because you're, a, you can give me a perspective that's like completely foreign to me, because I don't do just like one game, you know. I play what I want to play. Like when when the new Pokemon comes out, I'm playing that. When the new Rainbow Six Extraction comes out, I'm playing that for a bit. I'm gonna give that a go. You know. It's on Game Pass. It's a, a day one on Game Pass. Rainbow Six Extraction is day one on Game Pass. You, you uh, have you not seen the news, Wolfie? Right. So let me just keep get you updated, updated with the gaming news. Um, yes, a, a lot of people's perspectives are foreign to me because I have a really just very odd perspective on the world. Um, so, so basically, um, I think it was at the start of the week, uh, there was an announcement that Ubisoft will be bringing Uplay Plus to um, to Game Park, to, to the Xbox. So if you want to access... Uh, no, right, so this is the thing. Then Dealer Gaming made a misreport and uh, said uh, said that it was going to be coming to game pass so you play plus was going to become in part becoming part of game pass ultimate but he he read the article wrong because that article also mentioned that um rainbow six extraction would be entering into game pass on the 20th day one when it comes out so you'll be able to play Rainbow Six Extraction Day One, and because of the way that they bundled both the articles together, he misread it and it said that um, that game that you play Part Plus was coming to um, UB Plus was coming to the uh, Game Pass Ultimate, but a lot of people are speculating and conjecturing that the the introduction of UB Plus to the Xbox and Rainbow Six Extraction to Game Pass is just a gateway um, test to see how well the the Game Plus the Game Pass subscribers are willing to jump on um, Rainbow Six Extraction to give it a go, and if it does well enough, we may end up seeing probably by the end of the year, start of next year that um you play plus or ub plus whatever it's called 
will be integrated into game pass ultimate subscribers um service as part of the package yeah. and we could end up seeing both uh, ea access and ub plus uh added into uh game pass <laughs> yes ea access is but if you listen to everything i said there phoenix you play plus isn't and with the fact that there is um that it's coming to the xbox ubisoft are using it as a measuring stick No, no, I said it will be both of them will be and then added or then it'll be part of your you your Game Pass Ultimate subscription because EA Access is part of your Game Pass Ultimate subscription. It is. If you have you uh, Game Pass Ultimate, you have access to EA Access. And that's what I was saying. They would be adding you play on top of EA access to Game Pass Ultimate. I mean, Wolfie understood what I said. Wolfie understood what I said, though. Yeah. If if you play plus is added in on top of EA access, with Game Pass Ultimate, I think we could honestly be seeing the beginning of the end for Sony. <laughs> I know it may sound harsh. I don't think... It... I honestly don't think that Sony would have any way of turning um, the, the Project Spartacus into something worth getting. Because if you don't know what... If anyone doesn't know what um, Project Spartacus is... Project Spartacus is Sony's attempt at making a Game Pass service for Sony. Because what they're basically doing is amalgamating PlayStation Now and your PlayStation Plus membership into a, into a combined service. That's their way, that's their competition, that, that's their way of competing. Yeah, but that's the point. They're saying it. PlayStation Now and PlayStation Plus are going to are going to become <laughs> are going to become integrated event uh, part of this new integrated plan with um, with um, Project Spartacus. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Project Spartacus is just a crew too. I, I don't know about that one, Josh. <laughs> I mean, I mean, a wet sandwich would probably be better than crew too. That's you. <laughs> That's you fighting it there, bud. <laughs> I mean... That's tenuous at best. You can roam around in any open world game, to be honest, mate. I don't know what that was. Go on in. Ha! <laughs> you called it the crew, you dirty bitch! 
We just crewed out of it. I mean, I can't show you proof that it's not, but I can show you that your your connections are tenuous at best. I mean, to be fair, I can't, I can't not deny that Project Spartacus is just the Crew 2. But given the fact that the Crew 2 is out and only has 7,000 people or, or 10,000 people playing it, it would be a waste of Sony's money to, to even invest in something like that. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> however, however, I will say that Sony are pulling another uh, sneaky, sneaky, dirty move at the moment with the way that they are trying to stonewall, um, stonewall uh, Final Fantasy to come to um, to Xbox by throwing crap tons of money at Square Enix just to keep Final Fantasy 7 remake off of um off of Xbox consoles is kind of shady I mean I wish I mean I wish I mean given the fact that um that people that people are, are are aware of the fact that epic paid for the exclusivity to their store or um for the um for the for the um pc version and steam didn't bother to put a bid in shows that the main interest for or Final Fantasy for, for people is getting it on their consoles, getting it on their Xboxes because they're waiting for it to come to Game Pass. So... You know where mine, mine, subs, mine, mine expri uh, expires? Yeah, it's like June 2023. But because I use the um, the Xbox rewards and I do that on a daily basis, I actually have not paid for Game pa uh, uh, Xbox Live or Game Pass since it's ever been released because of uh, Xbox rewards. Because every every time I get 35,000 points, I just get another three months worth of Game Pass Ultimate put onto my account. And I just keep doing that. And I've... Yeah, that's the... That, that, that is the actual Xbox account. I'm telling you. Yeah, they're telling you to, to start using your Microsoft rewards. Which is the Bing rewards. What, a verified system on the Xbox? I know, right? That that actually um that actually got dropped down apparently, Krim. That price got dropped down as well. But I never saw it. You don't need an app, it's just straight off of the Bing Rewards website. Um... 
save up for the if you if you can afford it and have enough uh, points saved up or accrued and are earning enough on a regular basis by doing your searches and the and the thingies and the daily signings you should be able to earn every like two or three months enough to get yourself a three month um a three month card which is thirty five thousand points if you are level two if you're level one it's thirty seven thousand What is it? Uh. Yeah, uh, pretty sure of it, Krim. Give me a second, I'll double check it. Yeah, but that's uh, something you should do every day on um, thingy. Have you been doing your um, fruit lab as well? Yeah, make sure you're signing in on your um on your PC, mate. I mean on your on your phone, because you could do this. You could do the signing on your phone, and if you keep your date your your signing bonuses up, you can um you can get yourself your um your pit points as well. I mean I'm sat at almost three million pips at the moment. Go, 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 go. For those who don't know, um, Fruit Lab is another site that I'm also partnered with. And it basically is where I also put up all the content that I do on on here on, on YouTube, but at a later date. So it's like, it goes up here primarily. And then like a, a day or so later it will go up onto um fruit lab and then that earns me passively with that community as well because the um pips that i earn from there and then allow me to do things for the the channel here like i can i can get copies of games and stuff like that for free and eventually, if I can get enough passive income coming in from Fruit Lab, I'm actually thinking about doing giveaways off of my pit point. For example, um, let's, let's just use um, a game as an example. They um, will go PC. Say, um, say Krim wanted a copy of a game, Krim won the giveaway, the, the hypothetical giveaway that we're, we're apparently talking about right now. And he wanted a game for his PC, and he wanted, say, um, Halo, or, or, or Rogue Lords, whatever that is. He wanted that. I would then pick up the global Steam key, the global Steam key for it, and then I'd send it over to him. Can you have a loan of a million pips? Well, the interest rate is 69.69% 69 .69 a day. Okay. Can you afford the repayments? What is... Have a look. Hi, sweet. How you doing, darling? Uh, videos. Uploads. What, the, the one that just went up four minutes ago. 
Okay. Okay. I'm the, I'm the first commenter. Oh, that one. The one where you couldn't even find the door. Oh. Yeah, I'm doing all right. The memes. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Your highest is three pound fifteen. No. I mean, do you want to know? Do you want to know what's happened to mine? I put up a put up something the other day. Um. Uh. The. the there is a couple on there that's doing quite well. Um, the slammed out of nowhere and tree flips are doing really well. Right, so we're going to do the winner winner. Uh, or, or where's Zen gone? Zeno, are you ready? I don't think Zen is there. How are things going tonight? Um, they are a lots of fun. We've been having a laugh and a joke, and uh, been hanging out with um with my buddy Sid and. And Josh having bants over over um, the crew too. Um, we've been talking about Project Spartacus. We've been talking about the fact that um, Rainbow Six Extraction is going to be available day one on on Xbox, and I will be playing that on stream with everyone who wants to come and play. Um, just having like different conversations and then the fact that we've got um the new pokemon that comes out at the end of the month i will definitely be playing that and just wait to hear back on the whole um monetization thing soon hopefully i'll get sorted out real soon And then, yeah, what? Yeah, what about it? No, it's not the first Ubisoft game, no. But it's the first trip, it's the first day one title that's gone on there. Wow, one, two. Yeah, no, I know it's the fir very first new release day one title. I mean, I think I hope it does do well for for the um, the Game Pass and brings in more games for us to play. You know, I mean, I don't care if it's a price increase. I don't pay for it anyway. <laughs> I mean, I bet you you can never keep everyone happy. You know.
Yeah, or just increase the whole price. Yeah. I, I think I think it'll bring more in more people than you think, you know? Hi, hello. I tank. 65k. There we go. Another car. There's the Corvette. Oh, nice. Yeah, I mean, I'm doing pretty good. Yeah, I know it is. I know that's poopers because of him DMing me on, on Discord. Because on Discord, he's known as Tank. Okay. Hey, I remember. Nice, dude. It is, isn't it? Yeah, I, I don't want to buy them all. I don't want to buy these ones. Yeah, I know, but... I know, but I don't want to. I'm, I'm tight-fisted. <laughs> <laughs> They're my points. I don't want to spend them. <laughs> no, maybe. No, I've been doing all my spins on this one. Thank you very much. I've got none. I've got no spins. See? None. I've been good. I'll have you know, sir. I have been very, very good. I've made sure... <laughs> yeah, it totally is. I, I am having a lovely day today. Thank you, poopers. They're having a lovely day of having lots of fun. Oh. Okay, mate. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, why not, right? Yeah. See you later. I really need to have a shave. It's tickling my nose. Oh. It's fucking the poopers out of me. What is that one? I, th I, I think we were just doing them. I know, right? Yeah, Phoenix doesn't need to do them all. Do you, you've done them all, haven't you? I don't even to do them then. Um, what race you want to do? Let's do what something long. Okay. 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 Hypercars, yeah. Oh, 
supercars. Okay. Modern or retro? Modern. A bit modern. A bit modern. I put any class goes. I've got up to S1. I know. I just I couldn't be asked to set it to S1. So. <laughs> I don't care what you drive. I don't mind. I think I might get Cyberpunk 2077 for PC when you've got enough pips. Oh, nice. I mean, I wouldn't, personally. I'd wait until they actually fix the game. Or I'd wait till it's on the sale and pick it up then. Because of how broken the, the game is, it's really not worth picking up right now. But here's the question. Here's a question for you all. So, if if um you play or you UB Plus thing gets added into Game Pass, and they say you can either a they can what would you rather have them do? Increase the price of Game Pass Ultimate. Or make it an add-on price of Game Pass Ultimate. So you buy a Game Pass Ultimate and then you've got an add-on price of UB+. What would you prefer? I've, I've played it for six hours, sweet, and I've put it down and I haven't touched it again. Yeah. 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 I I am all for them upping the the price of ultimate to include it in there even if even if I'm not taking advantage of it every month. You know? I feel that it would benefit the users of Game Pass in the long run. Seriously, but don't play Xbox much. Yeah, I understand that, Poopers. I mean, I love my ultimate editions of, of Assassin's Creed. I've always bought those. How would that work though? Um, as I have Game Pass paid up to, I mean, your your price wouldn't go up. Your price wouldn't go up because you're grandfathered in. The way it works is because you've already paid, you've already got your Game Pass prepaid for. It you you would only get an increase in the price after the the um, existing uh, price point has run out. So, if you continue to add, if you was to go to, say, Walmart now and pick up a bunch of um, Game Pass Ultimate cards and then just slowly increase the amount that you have so that you stay at the maximum capacity of, say, two or three years or whatever it is you can have, if you stay above that, if you stay at that maximum, you should never really see an increase in the price of it. I mean, to be fair, Krim, you're you're one hundred percent right there, mate. Nintendo honestly need to really start paying attention to what they're doing because an increase in price for uh, uh, Nintendo Online when there's no improvements in the service, just an add-on pack, it's just not cool. You know, um, so Sony are are trying to compete in that market as well with the progress of the, with the, the the project Spartacus that they're making you know
yeah so basically um with with um nintendo online suite you have the nintendo online which is i think 20 pound a year unless you have um the nintendo family pack which is i think 35 pound can't remember how much i pay for it um they've added an expansion version for that you know they've added an expansion one for that which includes sega genesis games all of which all the sega genesis games though mind you are available on the console as a standalone thing in the sega genesis ultimate collection pack which you can just buy off of that store the nintendo 64 games which aren't good ports they have been slated really badly as really bad port overs and that's what they are they're not like integrations or new versions they're just really bad ports like the mario 35th edition uh, 35th anniversary edition version of nintendo 64 is a better port than the port that is on the nintendo plus expansion pass and then there's also um the dlc packs that they're adding into it the first of which is the animal crossing dlc pack that animal crossing dlc pack will be yours for as long as you're paying for the expansion pass and the expansion pass doubles the price of the nintendo online if you're paying for a family pass it goes up to 110 pound if you're paying for just your own one, it goes from like $25 up to $50. They literally doubled the price for it in every currency. For a bare bones experience. And they haven't improved the, the, the service as a whole at all. I mean, I'm always paying attention to that stuff, so you don't have to, sweet. I'm actually thinking about doing like a a, a news uh, video where I talk about all the new things that have come out this week. Or doing daily shorts where I just talk about it. You know? I mean, I'm not bothered about competing against IGN. You know? I'd just be doing it because it's something I could do as a members-only thing on the community page. I could do it as a community community members-only uh, part. You know, it's a little insider thing. You get Dino news on a weekly basis, which would be another cool thing to get. You know, which adds more into the memberships. So then I, I could compile all the all the news stuff and then post it for the members only. What? What's the, the name? Dino's news droppings. Oh, you dirty bugger! Dino, Dino news droppings. <sighs> Zeno's terrible. Go sit in the corner. You're grounded, mister. You are grounded. I know news droppings. Well, I never. And with regards to the member thing, I'm still waiting for the, the, the uh, ID to be delivered. It's a 48 hour thing, but because we had a little hiccup with it, it's delayed it a little bit. So if they if if they get back to me today or tomorrow over, I don't think they'll get back to me over the week over the weekend. So I'll have to wait until Monday for them to get back to me, and then hopefully first thing Monday morning they'll respond to me and let me know if what i've sent all the paperwork sent through and done and then it gets confirmed and authorized and sent out and then i can get the uh adsense stuff finally squared away and then get that sorted back up and have that up and running again i 
because right now our members uh, is, uh, it's uh is actually not working right now until that is on if you have a recurring uh payment set up it will just continue to go and then retroactively it'll go on which is good i'm j what i'm actually trying to do is i'm trying to don't make sound silly you know like i'm trying to burn myself out but i'm actually trying to make the the memberships as as worthwhile as possible you know and i do need to get the um sizes um for the the desktop the background for people um done I need to get those finished off. Those are waiting to be finished. We've got a couple done so far. Um, we've got like a, a night one. We've got a day one. We've got um, uh, seasonal ones as well that are in the works. As well, a buddy of mine helping me with those. Ah. Oh. I love cat meows. Lass is actually asleep on the, uh, in the kitchen at the moment, so I can't get him to give you guys meows. Oh. No. There you go. A class. Bing, <laughs> Black like car, I'll drive that. I want to do it. I've got two of these, so I might tune one up. And if anyone does want to come play, you're more than welcome. Oh yeah. Mm. Take your time, darling. This is a nice car. Oh, sorry, Phoenix. It's rear wheel drive, um, Zen, so be careful. It is a nice car, it handles really well. I love muse. You know what I'd like to set up? 
I'd love to set up my 360 again and just like play some Guitar Hero again. But I can't do it in my current setup. Because I just don't have the space. My, my, uh, my, and the, um, the old guitars aren't supported by the, um, 9th and 8th gen consoles, so, but I can stick my, uh, my, my receiver into my Xbox and I can play Guitar Hero Live, which isn't great, but it is the best of a bad situation. I haven't played that in a while, so I may actually give that a go. I know I couldn't play it on stream because all the music is DMCA'd, but... What? No? Yeah? Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. And Twitch is Twitch is losing people too much. Did you know that YouTube now has a Twitch channel? And do you know what they did the other day? They had um um Ludwig on the YouTube channel <laughs> I thought it was so meta Yeah cuz cuz Ludwig apparently has left uh, has left Twitch for YouTube and apparently I saw it on a like a, a news post I don't know if it's like 100% true or anything Apparently, there was a YouTube channel on uh, sat on Twitch yesterday with like a quarter of a million people watching on it, and it was Ludwig's content of him being live on YouTube, and it was like L catch Ludwig now live only on his channel on YouTube. Watch it via the YouTube channel. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, you what? Oh, it just, it tickled me. Pokimane has been banned for the weekend on her channel. I mean, Pokimane can just stream over on YouTube then. I mean, but Pokimane can just stream over on, on YouTube if they wanted to. They have a YouTube channel. This is the thing. This is what, this is what Twitch doesn't realize. If they do that and um, ban a person of the size of like Pokimane or say um um sweet and eater if, if they were to ban them on their uh, off their off their twitch channels for x amount of days or whatever they could just go live on their youtube channels it's not stopping them from going live and it's yeah Move to YouTube. Right. Yeah. I just find that funny, though. You know, if 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 
Twitch content creators that are big, like Pokimane, are using, um, are, are basically it completely disregarding Twitch's DMCA guidelines and using it as like a, a an FU to Twitch. Hilarious. Yeah. Catch a grenade. Oh, yeah. Oh, I haven't driven this yet. yeah yeah that's basically how twitch has been for years though well this is this is the this is the the hilarious thing so even if you was a partnered content creator on on um on youtube on twitch you need to be in that top one that top 0 0.2 percent no, it's zero point two percent. It's zero point two percent of um, content creators on the platform, which is like the top six, like top thousand people, are only are the only ones making enough money that is above minimum wage. So, anyone who is a partner who is not in that top one percent, you are earning the same amount of money as if you was working at McDonald's. You know, you are earning below minimum wage or lower as a content creator. However, yes. Yes. I'll, I'll have to wait. However, as I was saying, um, if you are, if you are on YouTube, I don't what um um Grim what me what me question mark what what what. Yes, I'm talking to you. What's up? What's what is the issue? What is the issue, Quinn Quinn? What is the what is the the um grim for, Bubbo? What is my little goblin wanting? PC is being naughty again. What do you mean? What's happened? Oh. Send me a picture or DM me on Discord because I can see Discord as well. Anyway, as I was saying, I'll wait for kicking you off your games. Which ones, sweetie? You don't have pictures. Which games is it kicking you off of? all of them is there a response raft elder scrolls monkeys 
Have you restarted your computer? For those who don't know, Goblin Quinn is my partner, so they get free tech support. It's just freezing them. Okay, well, have you tried shutting your computer down completely? And then shut down your complete, complete computer completely, do a restart, and make sure that your PC, you don't have a dozen windows open. No, no, not basically turn it off and on again. Actually do a restart, because just shutting it down and turning it back on doesn't actually turn the process, like restart the whole computer. You need to basically power cycle the system, because... Doing a restart clears all the caches. Is the way Windows 10 is set up. When you turn it off, it leaves it into an instant on return mode. So you're not actually shutting itself all the way down. It keeps things on in a very low power state. Nope. Swear. You go do that, and then I'll uh, then let me know if it does it again. If need, if, if, okay. See you in a moment, sweetie. Right. Right. What was I saying before? Before? Before the goblin distracted me? I was talking about something. Oh yes. Oh yes. So um. Yeah, only 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 a thousand people on Twitch are actually making any money above minimum wage. So any other content creator who's big or successful that isn't in that that zero point one percent, which is a thousand people on the whole platform, give or take, um, they are earning either minimum wage or below. Yeah, but. When you compare that to YouTube, the number is closer to about 6 million people on the platform are earning enough revenue from their channels to live comfortably above minimum wage. No worries, you do what you got to do, darling. It's something like 67% of content creators on YouTube who are monetized are earning above, min above minimum wage to the point where they are living comfortable lives. And that shows the viability of YouTube is extremely higher than what Twitch has to offer. And yet people think that the only way you can be a, a content creator and, and be streaming is on Twitch. And with the stuff that's going on with like Pokimane and all that stuff and, and them doing all that stuff, it's quickly going to help change that mindset, you know? Can we do the airfield cross-country circuit? Yeah, of course we can. Yeah. I'll drive down to it now. Like driving, don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I know this game. I can fast travel, but I feel like with a driving game, the point is that you can drive down there. You know. Yeah, you know, it, it may not be as uh, as air quotes air quotes big as um as what a crew two is, even though the crew two isn't. Um, it has, uh, the density of this game is a hell of a lot bigger. Okay, you restarted your PC. Right. So, have you checked your drivers on your PC? 400 yards. Turn right. 
have you checked that your 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 nvidia drivers are up to date because remember last time when this was happening your nvidia drivers were not up to date and that was causing the issue with them restarting of the game your drivers yes please tell me you know how to do that as i did show you now i know it's not a car for you the program needs to have its its software updated the hardware needs to have the software updated have you updated the software for your graphics card This is the way the gobbo now tells me no i haven't done that yet. right so you need to go on to the, your main monitor and you know where the clock is and it has the little taskbar with the up arrow click on that and you should see something that says nvidia driver experience or nvidia experience click on that and check whether the drivers are up to date if they are not up to date update them okay Rally monsters again. Yeah, I guess. I guess so. Your eyes hurting you, buddy. No worries, man. We could always talk in the chat and interact with everyone. Have you found it, sweetie? I was just getting rid of my little notifications in the bottom left hand corner. <laughs> it bugs me. The fact that the gobbo has gone quiet now makes me worry. I really like this Porsche I've got, you know. This is a rally off-road Porsche. It's set up for rally monsters. Really good. you found it yet baby there is a thing i mean i i don't i can't see it so I, you'd have to either a send me a screenshot yeah do express install Yeah, yeah, you need to update your drivers then, sweetie. It might tell you you need to restart your computer again. Okay. Bring the world around you. We run the ocean floor. 
Nah, it's uh, see, uh, it's the, the wife's got a 1050 Ti. I mean, in an ideal world, I want to upgrade to a to a 3000 series GPU or higher, or or an AMD equivalent for both of us. Because we're both on AMD, um, it, I think we're actually going to be better off if we just go Team Red on both of our rigs. Because then we can access uh, some of those unique features with our AMD um, chips and stuff like that. Okay, give me a second, sweetie. Hey. And I'll have a look, okay? We... Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Do you can you can do um the yeah do the one that's green, sweetie. Your screens will go black at some point because it's updating the drivers. So the graphics card will shut down the, the, the ports that show your screens, okay? So don't panic. Usually, for those who don't know, I do all the updating and stuff on my partner's computer. And I usually take care of all this stuff. Under the sea. Did that get you your thingy? Yeah, it'll do something sweet. Bear with it. Okay, what's it doing? Okay, it's installing that. Then it will go black screen, okay? Not on it on uh, dedicated graphics cards. It doesn't because it'll have to refresh all the all the ports. Yeah. Yeah. It's it's uh not all the time though. That is odd. Okay. Okay, sweet. You will need to, um, okay. It's installed. Okay. Um, if it doesn't tell you to restart now, then you're fine. You can just try to play your games. Okay? 
if it tells you to either re restart now or restart later we restart now and let it restart and then then try playing your games okay Super freak, super freak, super freaky. Freak, super freak. Early, but the next Horizon Arcade event will begin shortly. Enjoy. Let me know if it has any issues, sweetie. Right. Um. What do you need to do now, buddy? Okay. Yeah, what do you need to do? Like, what ones are you? What are you trying to work on? I have a the story's a single player only though. You mean the the um, you've got yeah, the Titan. Goliath, the oh, you mean that the showcases? Okay, okay. Well, we could do all the showcases. Yeah, sure. Okay, well, we'll go do them all. We'll work for them all. Turn around. Hey man. Shortly. Good luck. Turn left. Yeah, I mean, I've, I've done all the races, but all the races completed. I mean, the races happened organically through playing with everyone else. Yeah. Yeah, I understand that. Here we go. This city. Put this city on rock. Yeah, I'll build this city. This city on rock. Yeah. No sausage rolls this time. I like the sausage roll version. I know a lot of people don't like the sausage roll version of we built this city, but I do. I think I think Lad Bible is absolutely amazing. Yeah, he's had two Christmas number ones. <laughs> I didn't know there was. That's the number. Listen to the radio. Yeah. This city on Sunset Road. Lad Bible is amazing. I actually follow his TikTok. It's hilarious. I love his TikToks that he does with his wife. Where he'll be sat there doing something and then his wife will come in and start dancing. <laughs> They're hilarious. Welcome back, darling. Interesting game. Whoa, let's go. Only face for mamba. Listen to the radio. Do 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 do
Oh, let's go. I'm gonna shift down. So it keeps the RPMs up. Because you don't want to be in a, high, in a high gear in low RPMs because you can stall the engine. Oh, it's motorbikes. Oh, that's the turn. Wow. Oh, fine, you're fine. Fun. <laughs> oh, I broke later there. I let you go to take it, and you broke later than I did. God damn it. Listen to the radio. Have you not? Wait, they wrecked the town. I fear shading, buddy. What with the bikes through the forest? Yeah, definitely. I love the fact that they've got the plane in it in this one. Oh, how you doing, buddy? How was your Christmas and New Year? Do you know what? You know what? They used to do, they did actually do events like that with YouTubers back in the day. Where they'd have a YouTuber do play a part of the game and then they would take the YouTuber out in a car of that type and then put them through their paces in the car and see if they can. I mean, yeah, no, yeah, not possible. The insurance alone for that would be astronomical. What? Oh, magic rock. Right. <laughs> There we go. Now oh, we're both doing the spinneroonies right now. Are you ready to race the train? Hey, Duke, how are you doing? A cold weather needs, I know, right? But the thing is, sweet. We sit there and we complain about the cold weather. Like, oh, I don't like the cold weather. It hurts my knees and my back and all that, yeah? And then when the, the hot weather comes and we're sat there like, oh, I don't like this. It's too hot. You know, <laughs> you can't win. No, apparently, I can't do it yet. We're still loading. We're both still loading. I know what to do. I'll fast travel. That fixes it usually. Is safe 
to do so. Yeah, I get that. Right. All right, I have two of those. All right, dude. Oh, I don't I only have one. Um. What have an SRT demon? Hello. Hi. What's all the face there? Could have got startled by the fact I said hello. Hello. Now, what may I do for you? Any? Oh no, you can't talk to him. He's mine. How are you doing? Wow, you've gone really far. There's 25 versions, 25 volumes of that version that he's reading. Okay, which is all 600 episodes. I looked into it for the that's, whole. That's volume one. Yeah, that, that's volume one, two, and three. I that's. Amazon for all of the, all of the compilations. Yeah, they're the compilation books. Yeah, they're all out of stock. Yeah, I looked into it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get them on Waterstone. It can be delivered to the house. Yeah. 22 quid each. That's not bad. Think about it. One copy of anime. Is you, That's one, like... One his, manga. His one book there is like 60 episodes. That one... He's nearly read that. Have you seen how far he's got it? Yeah. Like, if he has actually... If he has actually been reading it properly... I've actually read it properly. I read it backwards. Yep. Yeah, you read it from back to front. <laughs> Good lad. I've actually gotten this far in the book. And dog you About Cone. His name is Cone. He puts his body into a lion. Yeah, yes, his name is Cone. I call him a tiger then. No, his <laughs> name is Cone. 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 No, he he's, looks like he's an ice cream cone. No, K O N, Con. Yeah? Because his full name is Mod Congi Kongai. Little plushy lion. Uh, Look, yeah. This is Mod Kongi Kongai. This is Cone. Uh, yeah. Really, yeah. Yeah, Mod Kongi Kongai is his um, full name, and they call him Cone for sure. If he is legitimately enjoying reading manga. I'm really enjoying it. That's pretty good that he's found a. Book he's found that a. He he's read. found. He's found so, a media that he enjoys reading. You know, uh, we're gonna. We're going to be encouraging that because if he can get into it, then I'm why not, right? Really good. Do the school have any other copies of those? Do they have the, or is that the only manga that they No, they, they said the that from, from what I heard, I, I did message the school and ask them if they can get any more. No response back yet. It's clearly old. Have you seen how bashed yeah, it, it is? Yeah, it is tatty. Right. Come on, I know, Minnie. Z. Z. Hmm? Speaks as Z. But I'm really enjoying this. But if you're liking manga, right? If you want. Now, I know that, that the state of that, the condition of that book is, is no through fault of yours. But I'm telling you now, if I lend you. That's cool, mate. My volume one of my yeah, hero academia, academia if you if you wreck it i won't be happy with you i'm fine with lending you my manga but if you wreck it i won't be happy and i won't lend you any more. you know he sat there and has spent more time reading his 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 his, his man ang, bleh, manga. his manga and he has playing games today. Yeah, because I told him he's to bring it downstairs. He's really enjoying it, and I'm happy that he's found 
a form of novelization that he's enjoying. I told him to bring it downstairs with him, and he was yeah. like, I'm not allowed to read downstairs. And I'm like, yeah, you are. Yeah, why would you not be in allowed fact, to read downstairs? In fact, this light is probably better for you to read yeah, by than the daylight. light that in your bedroom. Yeah, because it's a daylight. Ben Paul. You can read downstairs. You can read upstairs. You yeah, can read we, I don't like. I like. don't like him reading That's upstairs because the light is not good for his eyes. Daddy it, would prefer it if you read down here because yeah. this light is better. If he, for your if eyes. he's, if he's getting into reading upstairs and would like to read upstairs, we'll have to get him a lamp with a daylight in it so then he can read upstairs by his own light. But then he has to be trusted not to turn it on. But when he's supposed to be in bed asleep. <laughs> Because that is something that he has issues with going to sleep, you know? Sounds like we might need to uh, get somebody a book okay. <laughs> Not yet. He doesn't have enough books yet. Uh, I, like... mm, I know. But if, but Minnie, like the... Minnie, right. would you like to have, have would you like to have all 25 novels? Yes. There you go. There you go. Oh no! I'm so I, I you no <laughs> no oh no! I'm so happy right now. Oh, I am cool. beaming with pride. My little boy's becoming an otaku. What a otaku! So happy. Sweet, you same hi, like, like Sweet, same hi. I said hi. I shouted hi. You didn't see. No, you went straight back into talking to Vinny. He likes that. Who? Oh, that's good. His little girlfriend. I like him. Oh. Well, when you go back, when you finish that book, when you go back, His little you girlfriend, for those who don't know, Minnie has a girlfriend. You can see this was a good. Uh, this, oh, she's already read it. Yeah. Did you have to? Have, did you? Did you have to have the domestic to try and get to borrow it, or has she borrowed it before you? Already gotten it. Found it. Is that the only manga in your entire school library? Yeah, that's. Right, I'm gonna re, re um fix this because it still hasn't fixed. Convoy. Ow. That's the only manga in his. Don't worry, school. I will sort it. I believe. Oh, right. And then. Oh, I'm happy for yeah. my little boy. Set you up a good meeting if you want. Yeah. I don't need a good read yet. And you can keep track of all. I need a good read yet. Oh. I haven't read all the manga. He's only reading one book. I only read one manga. Well, you can set yourself up little reading challenges. Like, how many. Yeah. <laughs> you don't need that. It doesn't. It's only a suggestion. <laughs> I don't need that yet. <laughs> He's only on one manga so far. Ah, I need the other one. Oh, it's the only first one. <laughs> <laughs> it's three books in one. Technically, it's sixty novel. It's sixty episodes. Sixty-five episodes. Yeah, but it's three books. Yeah, it's three volumes. Oh, what are you? Like I said, if there's no manga in your school library, I'll gladly lend you volume one of My Hero Academia. But he's if you not wreck reading it... Beastars, though. No, he's not reading Beastars. <laughs> no. If you wreck it, then I won't be best pleased with you, and I won't lend you any more of the manga. Oh. I don't wreck the manga. I. There we go, it's fixed now. If I don't... Good buy me. <sighs> Wait, how many are there? There are 25 in total, it's Minnie. 25. We will buy you all 25 oh, at that, once. At the end, on there. Because you can't read 25 at once. <laughs> I need one. Five. Um, after that, after that, nine. Come on. What? At nine. You'd have to give her a, a list. I know, I know the manga he's into. Well, right now he's into. He's into Bleach and he's into uh, Gimetsu no Yaiba. Demon Slayer. Yeah, he's heavily into Gimetsu no Yaiba. 
He loves Kometsu no Yaba. Who's your favorite character in Demon Slayer Mini? Is that the main character? Yeah, Tanjiro is is the main character. He's got Mini got very hyped over the second season. He well, needs to watch episode five. Well, together, I've watched it, but it I, it got I really that, like intense, and just, I wanted to just watch take them. Just a quick minute and go onto Amazon. I'm in the middle of a race. Oh. oh can't do anything. Can I do it? Um, you'd have to tab over. I, I you have to read it. Let me just do it after this for you. I'll do it. Guys, if I if I'm slow on responding, it's because I'm having to look down at um chat because I usually have it in the top left hand corner up on my top Sorry, monitor. I'll be like really quick. Yeah. If I remember rightly, the first volume. Yeah, we're talking about Demon Slayer right now, buddy. Oh, Demon Yeah, Kimetsu really no Yaba. Yeah, it's four quid. Yeah, it's, it's Kindle, uh, though. What? I, I have it on my Comixology. Me and, me, we, me and Minnie can read it on Comixology. Oh, no, we're going to have to buy those elsewhere. I don't I don't want him to have that. I want him... No, I mean, we if can... He's, if we, he's going to read manga, I want him reading from the books. Well, I, I have... Because a... I want to teach him that... I'm sorry... A book has value, yeah. whereas, a, a, technology does whereas a, a digital copy of a book does not. I'm, I'm sorry, but I disagree. I, I, I disagree. I don't, I don't think that those apps get their manga and stuff from legitimate sources. Comicsology get it from legitimate, so, legitimate sources. Comicsology is a legitimate thing. Because, because there are so it's many part... fucking apps out there are like, we have manga, and then it's No, it's Comixology is not a scam. Comixology is a paid app, and 90% of the um, revenue from your your subscription goes to the, um, the distributors that give them their thingy. I know. He won't read it. I know. He'll go on YouTube. No, 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 because I, I do all my Comixology reading, through my computer. It's on my big screen. Minnie's watched me sit there and read co from Comixology the other day when I was reading books. my latest episodes from well. Shattered Dimensions from Your Transformers. Oh my God, the new Shattered Dimensions was so, so good. I think I'd rather him have the book. No, I understand that, but still, if he if if he finishes that one and he's wanting to read, we can still read I Comics have I have a My Hero, I have all my My Hero Academia. I know, I know, but if he wants to read Kimetsu no Yaiba before he gets his copies of them, we can read them in his, read them on the books. We can read them together, me and him, father son time. I will, I will go and have a look on my. You know, we can read it together. How much? I know. I know it last time I looked on yeah. Amazon. Yeah, look at Waterstones, sweetie. How weird now I'm a big fan of Bleach. No, the reason why you like Bleach is because I showed you Bleach. Yeah, but I like it. There's nothing on that. You did what? What achievement? Oh, that was an achievement? I've gotten this far. Oh. Okay. Sorry about that. We were just having a family discussion, for those who don't know. We were talking about anime. Me, me, Minnie, and, and, and the Gobbo were downstairs. Gobbo came downstairs and we were discussing anime and manga. And Minnie has gotten heavily into reading Bleach at the moment. And so Mini wants to get the um, the uh, the volumes. Sorry, thank you. Mini, why do you keep apologising? There's nothing wrong with Mini. There's no need to apologise for for liking to read. You read all the time. I don't. Know. Yes, I know. I read all the time, Mini. I know, cause I like reading. <laughs> I 
I know, Mini does it. It drives me up the wall. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love my kid, but the, the constant apologizing drives me up the bloody wall. You know? Because there's no need. There you go. Just sent the wife the uh three in one volume edition link to water stones. Yeah, I, I know, I know, I know, but you shouldn't, because you've got nothing to apologize. Just why do you have to apologize for just being you? You don't, you know? Be proud of how awesome you are. You know? This is why I tell Minnie. Stop apologizing for liking something, you know? If you like something, be proud of it. It's something you like. If you are otaku about something, be otaku about something, you know? You know? Otaku related stuff is, is something, you know? I, I'm otaku about gaming and technology. That's my otaku ness. Otaku, for those who don't know, don't know, is like nerdy. It means it's a Japanese word for me, like nerdy fandom kind of thing. You know? Yeah, I know it is a hard habit to, to break, but it's it's easier to get him to stop stop doing it now than it is to break him of it later uh, later on in life, you know? Because he's got nothing to apologize for. He just needs to be himself. You know? And that's what we, we want to focus on. We want him to be proud of who he is. There you go. There's your otaku. Your, your true crime otaku. You know? Nothing wrong with that. You know, I want to do the gauntlet. I love doing the gauntlet. But a hound dog. I ain't all the time. Ain't that but a hound dog? I ain't all the time. No, you ain't for everybody. You ain't no friend of mine. Uh, yeah, I like that's my other attackerness. I love music. I I can't go a day without music. It drives me nuts. You know. It's just, it's the thing that keeps me zen. I'm a hound dog. I know the sound. I ain't a hound dog. I know the sound. In 400 yards, turn yeah. left. Whoa. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, I I'm, I know how, you know how some people were like, oh, I, I have to have background noise, you know? Mine is I have to have music on, you know? Because I'll sit there with music. I, I can have it as, as long as I can hear it at like a sub-audible level, I'm happy. Just as long as I can hear it, you know? Even if even if it is like such a low low volume that it's like background noise, that's fine. It's just it's it's it helps me keep the voices in my head from taking like focus. Because with threats, you get sub-audible ticks for some people, you know? And that's one that gets me, you know?
wife just sent me the complete box of um, Demon Slayer. It's £165. Oop. It's expensive being the manga collector. You know that it's like six months worth of um, Xbox Live. Vinny, you know I actually have a Bleach game. Hey, you haven't? No, I mean an, an actual game on on one of my consoles. Yeah, Go on my black on my on my black shelf over there. You see where Fable is? Oh, go over, go over to where Fable is. Hey. Yeah, go over to where Fable is. Move Fable out of the way. Fable, I don't know. Where... Fable three, the big one with the ring on it, the crown. Oh, that thing. Yeah, move it out of the way. See a PlayStation three game that says Bleach Soul Resurrection on it. Oh. Yeah, you might need to read it on the side. It's in the it's in the PlayStation 3 games, let's see. So a premiere is a live live viewing thing, okay? So basically it. it's like a light it's basically like a pre-recorded live event. Okay. And you can you can do a premiere and it's like you know when you go to the cinema and they they put the first ever viewing live in front of the audience and then there's also a chat box. Okay? That's basically it. Yeah, it's pre-recorded live content. You made it into pre-recorded live content, and then it goes from being live uh, pre-recorded live content and into full vod content. You know, after that premiere, the only time you would do like a premiere is if you're a a big channel and you've been working on a big project. Say, for example, um, uh. Mr. Beast was working on a video for six months and didn't upload and kept posting shorts saying, guys, we're working on a big, big project right now. When it's ready to go live, we're going to premiere it and we're going to have everyone be there and we're going to do a live reaction to it as well. And that's kind of what you do with premieres. Okay. Premiers don't do more harm than good. Because if you're not able to be there at the premiere, they'll be. It can hurt your interaction with your community. Honestly, premiers are an antiquated uh, tool within the uh, within your tool set on YouTube. Not many people use premiers nowadays. As far as I'm aware, the only time people use premieres are big companies like um, Xbox when they're 
doing pre-recorded live content like um their xbox uh their xbox announced stuff and um playstation with their um with their um what's it called um sony sony play events whatever it's called whatever they're called you know take a place that's the one should know that because I've, I've reviewed them haven't i is there any new gaming announcements that you've heard of um i've i've heard of everything really there's not much at the moment at the start of the year the only other real big thing that was really like like groundbreaking or like shocking air quotes news would be that um e3 might not happen this year due to covid again so um and they haven't even announced whether they're going to do a digital event so we may end up seeing a spattering of of e3 individual events this june but um jeff Keighley's already announced that um Game, uh, the Game Awards, uh, the Summer of Games event is going to happen. So, you don't have to worry about um, that. And he's already... But the thing is, with um, Jeff Keighley, it's like he's trying to to take the funder from E3 and, and turn it to advantage for his stuff. And I don't blame him. He's doing really good with his stuff. Yeah, so... We may end up seeing um, Xbox E3 event and a PlayStation State of Play at E3 uh, for E3 and a Nintendo Direct around E3, and then we would probably see Square Enix's um, Square Fest and probably a UB Play event and an EA Plays event, and then maybe just some. Uh, company uh blog posts regarding like um devolver digital maybe they'll do their event that they did last like last year and stuff like that if e3 is a, is is so good then why isn't there an e3 too um oh, there has been an e3 move or oh, there's an e3 for, for the better part of a decade mate e3 20 2010, 2011, 20, no, 2012, 2013. E3 stands for the Electronic Entertainment Expo. That's why it's known as E3. Because it's three E's that make up the word. E Electronic Entertainment Expo. E3. So... And then because of that, you've also you've also got things like um, PAX, and you also have Tokyo Game Show, Paris Games Week, Gamescom. Um, what's the other one? There is another one. Um, EGX as well. And no, Eurogamer was not um, EGX um egx is actually a company that is owned by the the pax team it is their uk division egx is the is the um is is basic is basically um egx uk eurogamer is is a is still a uh company and they stopped doing um events like um presentation shows because of gamescom gamescom crashed them I love the X class, mate. It's amazing. I usually have a drift version and an off-road version. This is actually my um, my off-road rally version at the moment. Probably one of the few cars I actually will have multiples of and have them set up all different.
yeah, so it may be a case of no E3 this year, but there will be an E3 um, announcement period. So E3 is usually between June 5th and June 15th, 10 day period. And usually we all have, um, if they do the live shows where it's them on the stage, you would have a big production show of of like Xbox and PlayStation and maybe Sony and Square Enix and EA and Bethesda and stuff like that. But because of the way that the industry has changed at the moment, sweet, we are actually getting more changes in the in the region of all digital events. That's why um, the Game Awards was so good for um, companies because it means that they can lower their PR budget a lot and they can just have Jeff Keighley or X, Y, or Z go to them and say, hey, would you like your thing shown at our event? We'd like to have it. And it actually means that they can focus more on the game. However, indie devs are the ones that suffer in this if they don't have someone like Idea Xbox or the uh, PlayStation indie team. That's great, mate. Um, I, I, I don't mind. I, I don't mind that you're talking about your content, mate. But I don't think people are going to leave my stream to come and watch your premiere, okay? With all due respect, I don't mind talking about your, you as a content creator and content that you like to create. But, you know, just a little bit of etiquette there. Okay. That's almost tantamount to going into another person's live stream and saying, Hey guys, I'm live now. Come and watch me. Just be aware of that. Okay. I have no problem talking about us, our, our similar things of content creation. Just be aware of that, mate. Okay. best way to promote a, a live a video is to use discord and not not someone's live chat okay or use social media most people usually frown on live promotion in their other in their streams you know Yeah, me, I'm, I'm more relaxed about it. I will just politely let you know. Uh -oh. And the corner. I am so far behind me. I am so sorry about this. I completely, I completely cocked up on this one. Yeah, I know. I just, I, I feel bad having to be right back at last. I am so far behind because I messed up a lot dealing with uh, showing many the bleach game and stuff. I rolled away from my death. I'm I sorry because I, I feel like I, I'm I feel like Zen is having to carry me right now and I'm I'm being a bad bad teammate. Sorry.
I'm not I'm not a Range Rover I'm not a Range Rover defender. I'm in the next class. I mean your your defender's doing good, mate. You know? The defender's good for off road. And rally. I know, but I, I, I still don't want to feel like I'm I'm dragging my teammate down for my subpar gameplay right now. Yeah, but it's rally cross because it goes off road uh, onto dirt. Yeah, I know, darling. But that, that's you're the one with the, the confidence issue, you know. You know, so you need to know that your your gameplay, regardless of whether you're doing good or bad. It's absolutely okay. And I know my, my gameplay is okay. I just wanted to apologize to Zen because he's having to carry me right now. Yeah, I know. I know, darling. And that's one of your endearing qualities, you know? Your EQ is off the charts. And you're always thinking about everyone else. Okay, mate, good. Like I said, Duke, yeah, please don't use my chat as a lot of way of promoting your 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 stuff. Okay, what the Discord's for. I know, darling. But that's where we find our greatest strengths is from our weaknesses, you know? Gotta turn your weakness into a strength, and that's what we we wanna help you do. You know, you see it as a weakness, we see it as a strength, you know? God damn it, miss. I understand, mate. Just be aware, okay? Let me let, let me just let me just put it this way, Duke. Yeah. When when it comes to content creation, we have the the the, the space in the Discord to to promote the, the crap out of your content. Yeah. But talking talking about content creation is fine. Yeah. In chat, I have no problem with that. But when you're promoting your latest video or your latest live going up right now, you know, um, that's that's the way you flirt with the line of it being not good etiquette, you know? Because it's just, you wouldn't go into a restaurant and tell everyone in that restaurant that your restaurant is open and it's better food, you know? Or you won't walk into someone's house party and say, hey, dude, I'm having a house party right now across the street. Come over to mine. It's much better. You know, it's just a little bit of a social etiquette. Did you? Don't worry. I didn't know that for a long time on, on YouTube that you could um, retract your own um, comments for a long time. Because I never really clicked on my own dots. Because I wouldn't want to get, I wouldn't want to see you get banned in any any channels, Duke. Okay. Because I know you're you're striving to to grow as a content creator. <laughs> yeah, you could even turn on timestamps as well. I think it's at the top of the chat where it says live chat and top chat. Yeah, no worries, man. And make make sure you have it in live chat and not top chat. Okay, when you have it in live chat, it, it shows you all messages that are visible. Yeah. 
and then if you click on the three dots on the right side you could turn on um timestamps as well and with the new stuff that's coming in this year that stuff will change and get better there'll be better moderation tools for the mods there'll be better ui for you guys on on the viewer side and on on our side as the content creators they're going to improve that as well um they're all doing all sorts and as soon as i know what they are i can let you guys know when i can you know what i do you know i like to help and teach you know it's fun i mean that's i've got almost 13 years worth of um content creation experience duke you know i i mentor people from no no content to being content creators partnered on platforms in the past you know i did it on mixer with almost 100 different people i did it on um i've helped people on twitch take their content to the next level even though i was only affiliate over there i know how the system works i've done it on provo and d live and periscope and glimish you know i've experience over the years is translatable across every platform when you think about it you know but there is there is an unwritten rule book as it were a book of etiquette between content creators as it were i know you was darling i was so proud of all the success you was getting on mixer you was working so hard Yeah, we got you to affiliate on um on 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 Twitch. Okay. Don't worry. Don't even fret about that. The the all O tools that, that YouTube has are so basic and rudimentary that it's just a case of time someone out for five minutes and make them hidden from, from the channel. So they can't talk or or show or hide a comment and that's it right now they will get better there will be better improvements there will be better usage of the api and uh, utilizations through bots and stuff like that that will make it a hell of a lot easier but um eventually it will get like that and until that happens it's really rudimentary and it's very easy to self-moderate your own channel you know if you leave a comment unshown or hidden after a certain amount of time it will automatically hide it you know i am so far behind so don't have to worry too much about mods having mods is is a boon but starting out you ain't gonna need mods to begin with until you start getting a regular viewership where it's like it becomes too much for you to handle that's when you would look into getting mods and don't just pick any random person I always recommend using a jot form, which is a website you can use. Use a jot form, create a little um, application, and get people to apply to be mods. We have a little uh, we we have a little uh, command for that over on the channel. Yeah, well, there you go. You only started Halloween of last year. Uh, what minute? Um, what? Okay. So, as of I think it's July this year, early July. Um, I will be a content creator for thirteen years. But that's on the internet. I have been a content creator overall for on. 
Oh god, I'm, I'm, I'm going to show my age here. I've since since I've had a PC and a digital camera, I have been a content creator because I used to record my friends, edit the content, edit the, the footage on my PC, and then burn a disc, and they would then send it off to companies as uh, promo footage of them doing stuff. Hey, Lons, how you doing? And that was from the age of 15 that I was doing that because I had a very... I was very lucky and I had a, a very good um, good group of grandparents and great-grandparents who spoiled me. And that's over over 20 years. I mean, sweet, if you think that... It, what did, why do you think you you couldn't handle it? I mean, I, I play Forzas on, on Thursdays and Saturdays, Lunzi. You know? Right, there's the event. Marked it out. I mean, you don't. Right, I don't expect my mods to be at every single stream suite. That's the thing. I only expect of them six hours a week. You know, that's all I expect. You know, that's the minimum requirement. Anything else is you being amazing and awesome. You know, hey Lee, how you doing? Yeah, I know. I, I hang out with Lekka whenever I can. I know, and you said sorry, not sorry about Forza. I don't get it. In 400 yards, turn right. Yeah, you said sorry about sorry, not sorry about a rival thing. Turn right. I don't know what you mean by that. You know? Did you like beat a? Did you beat one of a time that I had apparently set? Okay, that was kind of cool. Flying X class. Yeah, I haven't even done the monthly rivals. Wow, you started up a company, dude? I didn't know that. Congratulations, Lee. Oh, awesome. How is that, darling? I've been okay, Lee. Um, we have a current issue with um, with um, with the members because of my my AdSense thing needs to be sorted. But um, once that gets sorted, everything turns back on again. Then you can be a member again. Here's my phone. Send them to myself. Email. Oh yeah, that's a good way of doing it. Yeah. Uh, so how you like Forza 5 over Forza 4? Um, I like them both. Don't get me wrong. There are some things that work better on Forza Horizon 4 over Forza Horizon 5. The game it handles better on, on 5. It doesn't have as many things that bug me. There are also things that do bug me on the game. But overall, they've done a lot of work to improve it. And I know it may sound bad. I think the biggest problem with this game is the fact that they supported it as a game available on Xbox 8th Gen. I think that the, they should have made it only available via xCloud 8th Gen because any other way it would it would be basically running off of uh ninth gen hardware so it wouldn't have as many issues i mean it is what it is lee it's a simple thing i just needed to get a photo id 
and because I don't use any photo IDs because I don't have a passport and I don't drive, I've had to get one sorted out. And the AdSense team have been great and have helped me get it sorted. So with the help of of my head mod, the AdSense team have got it sorted. And once I get the, the ID through and then I can send the picture of it to the AdSense team, they reactivate and it's all done. You mean you're, you've upgraded to 9th gen because Series S and Series X is 9th gen. Um, Xbox One, Xbox One S and Xbox One X was 8th gen. Got something. It goes bumping like this. Yeah. No worries, Lonzo. Oh, okay, okay. Well, um, I will get vengeance tonight to look at it tonight. Don't be sad about it. Series S is a beast. It's not very impressive. I be I I beg to differ. It's impressive because you took the time to fill it in and apply. There you go. Got something and it goes bumping like this. Like the Series S and X are amazing. To be fair, to be fair for those who don't know, the Xbox Series S is the best console for streamers on a budget. Okay, if you play, um, if you if you play if you stream, especially if you stream on Twitch, because. It maxes out at 1440p, 120 FPS. So if you have all your nice monitors and you plug that that bad boy in over a HDMI 2.1 port on one of your monitors, bam, you've got 144, 120 on that monitor. You just switch it over, bam, it's up there. You can play that whilst you have your chat and your other two, all your other stuff on your other two monitors. Bish bash bosh. And you're getting the best quality and you can get a capture card that isn't as expensive to you get yourself like the Ava Media Live Gamer Duo that will support all the features. You know? Yeah, I mean, well, the, the only way around that, Lons, is you just get yourself external drives, yeah? Get yourself some um, external drives yeah, and you use um, the external drives as your storage. And then whenever it's a, a Series S and X game that you need to play off of the internal, you just move it over and that's it, you know? That's all you need to do because you don't have to worry about that issue, you know? Because of the transfer rates are so freaking fast. The transfer rates from eight from a an external hard drive to the whoa he pushed me into you there to the internal is like almost insane yeah so there is the dedicated um internal the the dedicated proprietary ones that you plug into the uh, the uh, expansion port at the back they are ridiculously expensive right now. Don't bother with them. They aren't worth it. Wait till the patent that Seagate has ends and there are other other uh, distributors on the market, okay? And then once that happens, 
um, then look into getting the expansion cards what you can do is you can go and buy the official Xbox 8 terabyte or 4 terabyte um, external drives from the Xbox one generation and they are they are supported for the ninth gen console because I run two of them on my series X okay kind of you got a bit more you're using one eight you're using one eight terabyte aren't you I'm using two four terabytes so I actually lose a bit more I mean to me it is well, it should feel like a big job a duke because at the end of the day if if a person doesn't put at least 10 percent of the effort that i put into my content what's the point i don't want someone who isn't going to put the effort in i don't want a lazy mod that isn't going to mod or is going to be there and just lurk and not actually do any modding you know it weeds out the wheat from the chaff mate that's the whole point of it you know it stops people from trying to take advantage of me you know that is a good deal, mate. You know, there are people who in the past who applied to be a mod only because they wanted to be able to flex that power and ban people from my channel. You know? So... It is, it, is an, it is an important thing in itself to me because I put that much value on my content, yeah? And I don't expect people to take advantage of that, you know? This is the one that I would recommend, Lons. Give me a second. That one. That is the one that I would recommend that's a four terabyte drive yeah it's a hundred pound it it will allow you to store the games from the sns onto it but you won't be able to play it. you'll have to move them onto the onto the uh, internal you know i mean that's why I that's why I chose that one specifically there, Lee. You would totally flex. I mean I don't mind. You can flex all you want. You're a sweetheart. You wouldn't you wouldn't abuse the power. I mean I li li literally I could tell you I could tell you a horror story from back when I was when I was a small streamer. Back on the days of Justin.tv. Now we do the <laughs> All right, so basically, way back when Grim was a young dinosaur, he had a viewer who was also a very long, very good long-time friend. And Tiny Tiny Dino Grim was very, 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 very small in the fact that he wouldn't, didn't think he needed to be so restrictive with his mod team. And so he was like sure i need a mod you can be a mod and gave the, the the power of justice to this person and as as we know as uncle ben always taught us with great power comes great responsibility and said mod who we will call fred the mod or lack of for, for, for liability sakes so i don't get in trouble fred the mod then decided one day whilst i was off stream that he would go through and ban 600 people off of my channel because he didn't like them issue number one how the friggity frack can you not like 600 people you know You know? How? How the hell can you ban 
600 people. You know? And when I came on the next the next time I was streaming, which was about eight hours later, I had my DMs lit up. Why was I banned? Why was I banned? I can't I can't talk in the stream. Why was I banned? So I sat there live on the stream and unbanned all six hundred of them. It took me three hours. And when when said mod came into the stream towards the end and said, What the fuck is going on? Or why are these people unbanned? I went, because I unbanned them. He went, well, I banned them. I went, yeah, you didn't ask me. That's not on. He went, well, I don't like them. They shouldn't be here. And started banning them. I quickly unmodded him and banned him. And that is why I learned there is one thing you don't do. Mod your friends. Because those those friends that are that niche area that you 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 think they're cool could turn out to be an asshole when they have the mod of power. Or family vengeance. There's a difference. You're not just my best friend, you're also family. You're you're not and you're not the asshole. Shut up. Love you. No. No. No! Stop it, both of you. I mean... Wow, guys. <laughs> that kind of makes me sad. <laughs> because, like, I don't like most people. What is that now? I can't even see what Phoenix is saying. You're not even typing in chat. Oh, I can't see that then. Well, there you go. That's why I can't see it. No, I don't need to look at that. If he wants to talk to me, he can talk in chat. You know? You guys vengeance to approve my mod application. I made some very strong and valid points as to why. I mean, me and, me and Vengeance will look at the mod applications tonight. After stream. Yes, Vengeance, we have mod applications. <laughs> Yeah, no, I get that, but it's 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 confusing me. I'm gonna down twenty four cans. Of, why why are you gonna down twenty four cans of snake at once? Oh no, that that's that's Lee's one. He downs twenty four cans of snake and drinks three tubs. Yeah. <laughs> well, Vengeance will read it. Don't worry. Because I will print, I, I will send in the PDF of it. Why not? Because that much, that much sneak all at once would make your heart explode, mate. Uh, the fact that 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 Lee was able to do it and survive is a miracle in itself. What? I will send you them. They go to my emails. By the PDF. The jot form. Yep. Uh, let me just... I will send you them. I'm sending them to I'm sending them to, to vengeance right now, okay? Uh 
engine. By manufacturer. No stop by performance. Right. This is sweets. Yeah. Yeah, mate, that's that's not good, mate. You know that, right? Okay. Those are the two mod applications that have come through today. I mean, there's loads of like, great A plus cars out there. I have no idea. Lonzo, are you coming to play? Is he? No, he's not in my convoy, you dork. Well, I, I don't... Well, if, 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 if Lonzo wants to come and play, he could just send me a message. No, he's not. He's not in the game with me. I just think he's talking. I, I then the, the then the best thing to do, mate, would be to ask him. You know. I mean, we do all the seasonal stuff with people, Luns. If you want to get it done, okay. We don't care how, you, how good you are at the game. You know, you can't be worse than guns. You know? Yeah, I saw that message today pop up on my phone that you sent that. And then when I when I clicked on it, and it went to somewhere that doesn't exist, and I could never find the message. Did you delete it? Uh, on it's one thing to ban someone, but when you're banning someone because you don't know, uh, okay, you also uh... yes, yes, Scott, that is that is what happened. Accepted. Oh, sweet. You you probably will get accepted. If if Vengeance reads it now, Guns is an animal at every game. <laughs> He's got. The, he didn't have the best. In a business sense, banning people is bad because it hurts. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It does do. That's that's the that's the whole point why that person got banned in the first place. Because he tried to dictate to me what I can, what happens in my channel. You know? Yep. The JPEG link is a link to, the, to show that they have two factor. Yeah, it's because it's because I I don't I haven't sent that over. Yeah. I mean, you could discuss that with Sweet. I mean, if Sweet jumps into the to the into the VC, I asked if she was coming to play Lons.
<laughs> no, it's fine. It's fine. I mean, I do. I mean, yeah, Phoenix asked. But now I'm asking you directly, Lon, you dork. I'm asking you directly, Lons. Do you want to come and play, mate? Oh, no, I go ask him what? Okay, so I got to ask ask Lee if it's Windows ninety eight or Windows ninety eight S two. Is that what you said? Okay, Lee, I've been told to ask you from Vengeance, is it Windows 98 or Windows 98 S2? Okay. Is it weird that I have a crush on Vengeance but never seen him or kissed him before? I mean, that's absolutely fine, Lee. I mean, I, t I can tell you he was in my house yesterday playing Final Fantasy and he has a majestic beard. He's a sexy beast. <gasps> Why are you laughing, Zen? Yeah, I mean, mate, you... Oh, but you're, look, 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 let, let me just say, as a person who is follically challenged, okay, I appreciate uh, uh, a facial, a facial fuzz, okay, because I'm jealous, okay. A facial fuzz is something I am jealous of because I can't grow a facial fuzz. Why did I, why did I just do that? Uh-huh, I never said that. Thank you. Right, there you go, Lons. Oh! I mean, what do you think what comes of it, Duke? I mean, I only expect people to do 10% of the work that I do. You know? Shut up! Whatever, knobhead. Now they're just picking on me like, you don't get any of your achievements, Grim, whatever. You don't do any work, Grim. You just you just merely just acting like an asshole. Thanks. Assholes. Was ten percent enough? Think. I mean, it's still ten percent. Hi, Zen. 10% of nothing is still nothing. It is 10%. Yep. Ask Minnie what 10% is. Minnie, what's 10%? He's just staring at me now with dead eyes. No, he's staring at me with dead eyes because Minnie's like, oh, I'm a meme now, am I? Uh, good times. Ah, 
าน่าอยู่ left but it said you left it was four me you onzi and xenos No, then this wasn't part of the convoy. I hadn't loaded up. Yeah, who said he was playing? Token Forza. And as the saying goes, no time like the present. Right, Vengeance? Whoa, I saw that. Car just went flying then. That's getting clipped. Oh, I haven't. Yeah, because I bumped into a, uh, into a driver tar. Because I watched a driver tar go flying. Like he was in a Michael Bay movie. Uh, vengeance should be in, vengeance should be in, uh, spoken to in in um in string. He is deliberating right now. He <laughs> the monkey. Oh. Lons, what is ESBK? That's, yeah. What does deliberating mean? Oh, it means when you ponder on something. Am I using too many big words there for you, buddy? Made me giggle snort. Ah, oh, he's getting old. Good night, buddy. Oh. oh what happened there, Lons? Okay, look in chat. I, I'm looking at chat. Oh, what's that? Oh, God damn it. 
I am going to deny that that ever happened. That clip that Vengeance just put in chat is me snorting. There's the mod application link. Uh, do exclamation mark mod, mate. Hey. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Give it a second. There you go. We haven't updated the mod form for a while, so I do need to update it. Yeah, I know. That was when we was doing it. No one else has been clipping. I mean, I, I clip, but I own it clips all go onto my PC and end up as short. Okay, so this is totally not poopers. Oh, okay. So poopers is... You stolen poopers' laptop. Oh, she came with dark. That's absolutely fine. Yep, multitasking. Oh, that's not brakes. That's not brakes. I forgot. That's a break. Yes. Yeah. This car really doesn't have good brakes because it's D-class from S. Yes. Oh, I want to say what's that? I was I was talking to myself, mate. I was talking about how my car's um not got the best brakes because it's been declassed from um mess. But a hey. and it's just I think I couldn't improve the the brake. Yeah, I know, but I, I don't think that they're, they're the best brakes, you know? Okay, could put better on there. Or tinker with them a bit more. I did... Uh, oh, I, I just... I. I just feel like they're a bit too meh, you know? You need a question such as who do you think is the most attractive streamer and why is it me? I mean, <laughs> why do I need a question like that? I mean, no one knows what I actually look like apart from a, a few people, you know? Any streamer to mod white? I mean, if it, uh. I mean, we already know why it's you, Vengeance. I mean, it's the beard. 100% the beard.
Ah, oh, Scorp. Hold on. I just completely spaced on that conversation we just had, Fink. Did you say you're driving my car? Oh, okay. Cool. Are you liking it? Can I have vengeance if he listens to Freak Me by Silk and thinks of you? Um, as in Freak Me Baby, let me look you up. Now. The original version by Silk. He says no, Lee. He doesn't think of you when he listens to Freak Me by Silk. The original was by Silk, but then there was the, um, there was the, no, another level. Another level did a cover of it. I just, I just know 90s pop quite well. Growing up with, uh, growing up with a bunch of sisters who listened to 90s pop boy bands, you know? <laughs> And then watching a lot of movies in the 90s, like Ali G in the house, where they use songs like that. <laughs> like, uh, I'm not really a fan of New Kids on the Block. I wasn't really. Oh, no. I know that one. No. Name doesn't ring a bell. Again, names don't ring a bell. Need to hear the song. I have to look that up. I don't know the name again. The name of the song. I need to hear it. Give me a second. Remember, not good with names and names like that. I need to hear it. Give me a second. As soon as I finish this race, I will put it into my Spotify and I'll have a listen. Like, and then I'll then I'll tell you if I know it. Yeah, I know Duran Duran Culture Club. Oh. Yes. Uh, uh, Lee says he will no longer look up the stars thinking of you, Vengeance. Whilst wondering if you if you if you're whilst wondering if you're doing the same thing. That's a that's a a, a five reference there. Um where out there <laughs> I got the reference, mate. You put it onto my Spotify. Ah. Oh, there. No, I can't click that link though, right? Because it will put it straight over to, over my uh, over my Internet Explorer, and it will start playing it, and it'll go out to the whole stream. How broken? Yeah, that's how broken Spotify links are. That's why I always tell people to add it to the playlist. Oh God. 
Oh my god, did you hear what happened about Spotify? No, did you hear what happened with Spotify? Apparently, apparently, no, apparently Spotify had um, uh, um, account data leaked on Reddit. And, and um, it leaked uh, earnings of, um, of content creators who, ha who do music stuff. And apparently it leaked um, Harris Heller's stream baits. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if it's true or not. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I know that song. Yeah, I, uh, I know that one. Yeah, I know that one. Yeah, I know that one. I screwed up and missed the checkpoint. I didn't want to. No. Yeah, no, I can't. No, no. Definitely isn't. Got the collab playlist. You need a link to it. It should be in your playlists. Need a link to it. Give me a second. And once I finish this race, I'll give you it. Yeah, you need to you need to like the fight of the playlist and then you'll be able to add to it uh, can you click show on what um lee put in chat sorry i was just a little bit busy I read what he said, but I just forgot to mention it. That was funny, Lee. Then it says, obviously they aren't photos of, he, of him, because if they were, you would never take them off your wall. Oh, Zen's done a nap as well. Oh, come on. I mean, you're, and it says it's hilarious. There you go, buddy. That's the um, Kola playlist. No, I'm sending that over now. I need to give you access to the job form. I really do. It's been so busy. Um, now you find a song that you want to add right click on the song and then it should say add to playlist and then you'll find the playlist in there Oh, okay Oh, 
Lee, you make me laugh, mate. Add to playlist if you if it says it should say that it should be there. You can, can't you? Can you ask Vengeance to voice chat me on height? <laughs> yeah, I am concerned now. <laughs> Lee, Lee, have you have you have you been at the um the fire water today? Have you been drinking that fire water today? <laughs> right. Um, um, Lons, what um what events do you need to do? Are you sure you've only had one? And how big was the bottle? Was it the size of of, of a of a of a of a of a barrel? Did you stick your head in it and go glug 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 glug? Right. Pipe. <laughs> yeah, you need to do it via the app. You are hilarious, you know that, mate. It was just on the, the Rodson Customs PR stunt. Is that it? Is that all you need to do? I, mean, I can't. I can't do that for you. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I can see it now. No, I'm gonna play the I'm gonna play the last one you just added. Well, I be famous. At least. Lee, I could I could tell you right now, mate. I am not. I am happily married. Okay. Oh. Okay. I can tell you right now, those two will not be listened to. They will be skipped. I can't. St <laughs> I don't like. I don't like. No, I don't like. Right, said Fred. Never have done. Sorry. You're just trying to make vengeance jealous. I mean, I don't think you are, mate. Um, we're doing a circuit. I have it over to it now. Thank you for letting me know you're still running stream elements, but...
on, let me just check something. A serious note, bought a new TV yesterday with lights in the back to match the colours on the screen. So an ambi light, yeah? Yeah, it's called ambient backlighting. Yeah, it's Philips Hue, isn't it? That, uh, that they um, outsource that to. Yeah. Yeah, but it's... That's what it is. It's it's um it's that te that technology. Yeah, that, that's the technology that it's originated from. Yeah, that's the the original technology behind the ambient light that they use on TVs now. You can get you can get a, a, a set of light strips that you plug into the um, uh, the, the USB header on the, the TV, and it will do the exact same thing. You know. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I've been thinking about doing it. You know, making my TV glow on the back. I mean that's awesome dude I, I don't I'm not not knocking it I, I think it's cool little a cool little quirky thing you know it can really set the mood of a sh of, of a of a of a movie night yeah Have you um, seen the new technology from Samsung? For the TVs. QD, is it QD? Uh, QD dot? What do you think of it? A class. Um, I'm gonna throw in Where's my boy? No, I leave that to you Oh, 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 oh. Where is it? Oh, I can't. There it is. Yeah, it is. It is. It is pretty cool. Yeah, yeah I do like that technology. I think, I think ambient light technology is pretty nifty. Yes, I know. Someone's gonna say the nineteen nineties called Grim. They want their lingo back. <laughs> no, you know, it's called they want their ambient light back. Sorry for this. Don't mean to give you the ASMR. I 
I am not. That's me just filling up my, my cup. It affects me more than any than you guys because now I need to go for a pee. And I have to sit here with my legs crossed while we do the bloody race. <laughs> I mean, if you do, tag me on it. Uh, take a look around by Limp Biscuit, the middle main title from Stu Phillips. Uh, okay. What the hell is this? Oh, it's Knight Rider. Long two from Blur. I mean, I've got some of these on, on the list. They, they should be. They're probably under as... Yeah, they would be under there as, as as different versions. I like BTS. Actually, Dark put BTS on there for me. Me and Dark like K-pop. What are you going to do about it? Huh? Yeah, I know there is there is there is good K-pop and shit K-pop, but BTS isn't bad. I mean, there is so much worse. I mean, BTS is middle of the road K-pop, you know? It's very commercial K-pop. No, I wasn't having a pee. That was me filling up my my uh, my my uh, water jug. I already I already have J-pop on there. I also have J-rock on there as well. The art, the the genre, not the artist. What's A-pop? I don't. I do you know I've never heard of Australian pop. On who? Oh, what, is that actually Australian pop? Is that actually Australian pop? I did not know that that was. I just thought that was like some weird song that came over to the UK. <laughs> well, hold on. Does that mean that the Wurzels will be classed as British pop as well? Does that mean that Wurzels would be technically classed as British farmer pop? Yeah, it would, wouldn't it? It'd be classed as country pop. That's cool. I wasn't having a pee. I was filling up my, my, my coldest water jug. Not with P before anyone says with P. No. Whoa. No. So, what was your overall opinion on what you played of um, Final Fantasy VII Remake? Audience? It was what you expected for a PlayStation 5 version. I mean, could I, I, a big question is, could you see the frame drops in high action? So could I. I'm not the only one, thank God. Right, I'm going to quickly run to the loo, because now I need to pee.
back. Bob the Wilder was a banger back in the day. No, how dare you? How dare you? No, it's never a banger. Whoa! Ah, oh, two wheels! Okay, it's clipped. That recovery was great. Up on two wheels, pulled it back. No! What? Ew, why did I pee into my own cup? Ugh. Lee, you are one twisted individual, sir. And yes, have you have you looked through all of the um That was pretty cool there. Did you look through all the um the applications? Modded. You know what I mean? Yeah, I, I must have. I must have edited it. Speed of yeah. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh. I wasn't expecting that jump either, mate. Yeah. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Apple sauce, bitch. Hi, Barry. Ow. Yes, mate. Uh, Chandelier Metal Cover. Had it before. Great song. Unarism. Spoonerism. I've never heard of that term. Never heard of the term spoonerism. When you were rocking your shirt with the flames of your sissy cup and the straw, your P teacher DJ would bob. No, I never. I never had that, mate. Sorry. I never had any of that, Lee. I never went to anything like that when I was a kid. Uh, I'm what you would call an antisocial person. I never had many friends growing up. Wasn't really invited to the school functions. Because I was what you would call 
socially awkward. Growing up in the 90s with Tourette's wasn't a fun time. You know? I didn't get a lot of socialising done like most people would. <laughs> ah. Yeah. Yeah. I will watch that after stream, mate. Sorry. Didn't know you was coming in on the on the uh, trying to cut tight there. Yeah. me did my i mean you'd have to ask vengeance vengeance will tell you i mean we don't usually just like look at it 10 seconds and then and then take it lee yeah we don't usually make the decision straight away buddy unless we have our eye on someone specifically that we believe would be a good mod material we don't really make a decision like straight away we contemplate the 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 uh decision there's there is a there is a lot of um variable factors that t have to be taken into account a person's activity whether they're a mod whether they're a mod for someone else whether they're a content creator themselves what their schedule is if they are read their reliability you know I probably screwed this one up. Lee, you're really weird today, aren't you? I mean, more so than usual. Yeah, I mean, I mean, to the, I mean, to be fair, Lee. Uh, we may have to get that little squirty bottle and the roll of newspaper in a minute. 
Stop him from humping people's leg. Pylons. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't know if, if poopers would like it. Then again, poopers might. You might be flattered by it. You might be flattered by a bit of Welshman flirting with him. You never know. Might be, I don't know how to say that. Brain just got all befuffled there. Thanks for letting me know you're still running stream element spot. He said, I don't know. Why? Yeah, my quality closed captions are so great. Top tier, you know? Yep, top shelf. I mean, what? <laughs> yeah, apparently. Yep, all day, every day. Sold in six, seven, six or seven different varieties, depending on, what, on how I feel about it. I have never gone through a redum. Oh my god. Lee. Yeah, I've never gone to Sir Adam. I don't even know what Sir Adam is. I mean, I know what Black Adam is. Hey, Wayne the Rock Johnson is going to be Black Adam. Honestly, I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> oh god yeah get over here finish him <laughs> any what time
Stop it, Bow. Stop it, Bow. Go in. Hey. Oh, what? That is cool. I want the can. I want that can. I just want my can. <laughs> you love it, Lee. That's why you keep coming back. Keep him king by treating him mean, you know? Okay, that is freaking fire, mate. I want it. What's the flavor like? Apple and kiwi. What? Tommy Tank? No. Yeah, I'm I'm not gonna I'm not gonna allow that one because of what you the the first part, mate. First part condones condones uh something uh something that we, we don't allow. You know. Have to delete it. I read what you put, but I, I, I can't allow that in the chat. Yeah, I mean, you deleted it on your end. We, we grabbed it. No one else saw it. Only you could see it. It's such a dog. <laughs> Terrible. Nothing. Why are you giving the microphone kisses? I know.
Have you done the fight? Okay. Freezer. What? No, have you finished that fight? No, you don't have to. You can stop there. Okay, buddy. If you get out before 12 o'clock. Okay. Yes. Before 12 o'clock, not after. Not on 12 o'clock. Before. Hey, buddy. Hey, turn off your TV. Last, last, yeah, I know he did. E4? What? No, not E4. E4. This is a battleship, mate. I'm not trying to sink my battleship. I was telling Minnie that he wants his, um, his melt bomb. He has to, um, he has to get up before midday because it's a lot of sugars. I want those chocolate, you, you heat up the milk and then you drop the little chocolate ball thing in there and it melts. It's got little things inside of it. We got one of those. He got a big, like, luxury one. From school, and it says uh, when I've read the ingredients part on the back, it says that it contains like thirty thousand calories. It's like a proper rich one. It's like thirty thousand calories, something like that. I couldn't remember what it said. It's like oh, there's a crap ton. It's yeah, it's a crazy amount of sugars, you know. It's got like red velvet. It's a red velvet luxurious, luxurious red velvet Christmas Christmas bomb, That's Christmas like chocolate where? bomb, and it has um, it has like um, marshmallows in there and little crystal like chocolate stars and. I threw the box away. And he got it for Christmas as a as a treat. I threw what? the box away. I know you did. Yeah, it's like crazy amount of calories and it's like it's freaking solid. Only 10%. Yeah, definitely only 10%. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, I'm going to drive. Yes. <laughs> Where's the bastion? Hello. Hello, oh, Baba. Hello. As he's like posing. And <laughs> then put the microphone. Stop it. Come here. Hello. Oh, he's a good boy. Oh, come here. Oh. Hi. 
Come on. Good boy. He's a good boy. Come on. Oh, yes. You brought the AMG one on a on a cross country. Is it a cross country AMG one? <laughs> oh, this is going to be interesting. Here we go. Oh, I got some air then. at the um in the tree there i mean the forest kind of put it there mate because it's nature oh how the front end when it went skyward there Oh, I just took one out for you. Oh shit. I was stuck on a fucking... I was stuck on a building. <laughs> I am not a fan of the Leo uh, version of Chandelier. I am not a fan of the Leo version of Chandelier. No. Doesn't like it, his vocal range. He should have picked someone else to sing. I mean, everything else about it is great, but not his voice for, for it. You know? Yeah, I know there's a wall there, mate. Oh look, a, a third Sesto Elemento. Do you know what I'm going to do? Where is it? All these cars look. I've, I have three advantages. Why? I'll keep two of them. Two KTM crossbows. One will be done up. One of those is bad enough. Where is it? Oh, 
But the falls are addition, the falls are addition, and the falls are addition. I know there's all there. Yeah, I was about to do that. <laughs> right, garage, tuning. I don't get how you can have this, like, no tires, no tires. Off road springs. Believe it or not, it actually looks good in off road. If she asked, I'm going to go. Forgive him if he sends me a cheeky picture of your Xbox. Ebo face. What what the hell is Path? And what the hell is Bebo? <laughs> hey care, mate. Big weirdo. I don't know what half of the things you put in the chat are. <laughs> what the fuck is Bebo? I don't know what Bebo is. Oh, okay. 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 Yeah. Okay. Okay. That's... I feel really old because I don't know these things. No, like in that space. Yeah, see, I... I early days of internet i wasn't <laughs> i wasn't really aware of that sort of stuff i know right he's like still in diapers yeah what is that before or after he climbed into the hot tub time machine yeah true yeah, I was about to say, it's all that wibbly wobbly time you won't be stuff. Um, oh, albedo, yes. I actually started watching this show. Overlord. I have like so much to catch up on. I started watching it with a friend and then lost where I was because they had all oh, the oh, they they had like the link on where we were in it. I had to go back and start watching it. Albedo is is this Minnie's? Oh, did I tell you, Minnie's now gotten into um, reading the Bleach manga. He, we we found a series of um, volumes he can read, 25 volumes, and it's the entire manga series. And they're like a tenner each at Waterstone. They're around a tenner each. Actually, I just, I put this in off-road mode and it still handles great in 
on the road. That's insane. I mean, it's a little bit slidey, but I mean, the Sasto wasn't. I mean, it handles great, though. Yeah. Nine nine eight, though. I'd rarely ever use it. Um. Um. What do you want to do? I'll we'll do a Goliath. Be a nice way to finish. What card do you want to drive? X. S2. S1 or A. Okay. Oh my god. There you go. S1. Yeah, so games that we will be playing this month um dead Dead set games on the 20th, we'll be playing the new Rainbow Six Extraction. And on the 28th, which is a Friday, we will be playing the new Pokemon. And if I enjoy it a lot, I may move it also into the 29th, which is a Saturday. I don't know yet. No, I know it's a single player game as far as I'm aware, but it's it may have cop implications, but I like Pokemon and so I'll play in it And We're gonna have fun with it Here we go. Have you done your daily signing? Phoenix is in a Porsche and I am in a Jag. So the implications of this, um, this, this Ubisoft game, a brand new AAA title going into day one on on xbox game pass um has some rumored implications that it will end up leading into you play plus ended up on on the service you just said i appreciate that driver i appreciate that yes 
I mean, anyone who has Game Pass can download it and you can have three man teams on the game. So we will have to, if anyone does come and want to play, we will have to like cycle people. And we will cycle people in and out and get people in and out and do that. How are you doing today, driver? How was your Christmas? How was your new year? Yeah, or Hanukkah, if you believe in Hanukkah, Kwanzaa and all that stuff. I mean, how was your holidays? For lack of a better way of saying it. Yep, Saturnalia, yep. In the solstice. Yeah, um, stream elements is a bit slow at the moment. Keep popping in and out. May end up looking into bleh, using Streamlabs as a notification popper. Just using that. What? Yeah, I know, right? Did you did you get anything nice for Christmas or the holidays? Like, did you get like a new console? Any new games? Thank you for pushing me off, you stupid robots. Damn bloody AI. Clip me and push me down the hill. Yeah. Uh, one of them's up in the hill. How the hell he got all the way up the hill? I don't know. I got a really nice present from from my my partner. My partner got me um, a plushie that is um, Stitch from the Disney uh, movie Lilo and Stitch. And um, his name is Cloud after my recently deceased cat. Yep. So his name is Experiment Cloud. C seventy U E. He's a good boy. And then my wife went and made me. Um, a dragon ball because my partner does crocheting and is also a content creator on youtube they, all their content that they show off is craft stuff so it's like coloring and crochet and diamond art and really cool awesome relaxing things and um my partner made me dragon ball number four four star dragon ball christmas and my partner is going to make me one each year. So by in seven years, I will have all seven Dragon Balls and I will be able to summon the plushy Shenron. I mean, at that point, I would love it if my partner could make me a Shenron. That'd be so cool. And I'd have a, I'd have the seven Dragon Balls and a Shenron. That'd be so cool. Who needs Goku when you can have your very own Dragon Balls and Shenron? You know. Yeah. Well, technically, I'd have nine balls, wouldn't I? Because my two plus the seven Dragon Ball. Yeah. Yeah, and the eyeballs, obviously. Oh, I missed it. Oh, I missed a freaking checkpoint, apparently. Even though I made the flag go. Oh. Oh, yeah, I know, right? Yeah, so, um... And then... 
can have I could get all the all the Shenron I could get Shenron and then I can make a, a plushy wish. And then I'll have to throw the, the, the plushy plushy um dragon balls all around my house, you know. And then that that's a long time away and then this year um i've got a couple of games that i plan on getting over the over the course of the next 11 months and however many days got my eyes on a couple and ones that i want to get Iron like two is one that i will be getting and i'll be playing that on stream um rainbow six will be on game pass so i'll be playing that via that gonna be getting the new pokemon game uh, Legends of Arceus or the Switch and we're playing on string then there is um, Breath of the Wild 2 which is due to come out this year apparently and I'll play that on string and there is um, Final Fantasy Origins which is going to be a co-op game it's like Devil May Cry meets Dark Souls, but it's co-op and it's Final Fantasy. I'm very excited to be able to play that with my community. Be streaming that. Um, then there is Final Fantasy 16, Final Fantasy 7 Remake Part 2. Um, there's Stray, Horizon Forbidden West, God of War Ragnarok. Um... Forza Motorsport 8 or 9, whatever the new one is. Yes, I do have a Discord and a Gilded. If you do exclamation mark Discord, it will give you it. And then, um, then there is... What other games are there? I've got my eyes on. Nah. I think what else? The night I hope he's a gentleman. Bubble bubble is not coming. Out. Um, <laughs> they have also announced that they're. Oh, sorry, Sonic Frontier. Yeah, I, I also want to play that. That is the new Sonic Breath of the Wild game. Uh, there's the Wild West. There's that Wild West game, or is it Dead West? Is it Dead West, I think it was called. And that game that we saw that you liked the look of with the, the cowboy game, that's co-op vengeance. So that Wild West or Dead West game, whatever it was called. Um is going to be um going to be two player. Be a co-op game. That's gonna be cool. Um and we have um, a new Warhammer 40k game um, coming out. We also have Space Marine 2. Um, a couple others that are coming out that haven't got release dates, but I've got my eye on them. Starfield as well, which comes out uh, November, I think it is. Yeah, so we got a packed year worth of like planned content that we want to do. And all that all that time we also have Forza that we'll be playing as well because I love my Forza on also be doing some Halo. I love my Halo as well. Big Halo fan. Also want to try out that Crossfire X game as well the campaign on that apparently that's co-op campaign as well and then there's also the deals that are coming in through xbox with uh the new development studios are oh, there's so much honestly 2022 and 2023 are going to be the years for gamers Especially on Xbox, anyway. There's going to be so much coming. 
given the fact that Microsoft bought a lot of studios recently and they're still getting more. There is so much coming. Yeah, I think it's going to be a good year. Both for gaming, content creation. I hope that... I think 2022 will be my year to hopefully start. Okay, that's cool, dude. I hope that 2022 is going to be the year that we can start to recoup back to where we were and further than where we was back on Mixer. Whoa. Ooh. Yep, all my content is posted in the Discord. Um, so you get notifications in there as well as on the channel. Uh, and we also have... Um, there's also the Twitter, the Instagram, there's the TikTok. Got so many different places where we post content, you know? And I live alive. And I sleep this night. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, what if they're Pirellis? You never know. Is it? What about the jack? Huh? Oh, I might not have Forza Editions. Probably Toya. Whoa. Let's go, come on. was a big old jump up the up the leaderboard there <laughs> did you see that phoenix I mean, I, I don't doubt that. You're going to have a great year. I can feel it. You're going to hit the ground running and then you're going to get bigger than me. I know it. And then I'll have to look up to you and be like, oh, superstar of awesomeness. You show me the way. But as always, guys, it is midnight. That is our way to end tonight. So what we're going to do is we're going to hit the button. You can see the cool awesome transition. And we're going to say thank you to everyone who's been here. Thank you to all the members. Thank you to all the subscribers. Thank you to all the likes and the shares and all the awesome stuff that you guys give to the channel. Be it your time, be it a member, be it a like, a share. Is it a comment on one of the videos or one of the shorts we do? It's all greatly appreciated by the channel and by myself and by my amazing mod team. Thank you for being here. Thank you for modding. Thank you for the support in the channel and to every single person who's hung out today and chatted. You are amazing and I love your face. Thank you for being here. I will see you tomorrow. We'll be playing something else. We won't be playing Forza. It will be a different game. So you will have some new content. It will be something different from today. But I will see you then. Be safe. Be well. 
I hope you had a good holiday and you've come into 2022 ready to kick some butt and take some names. I wish you all the best for the year. And if you are not having a good day mental health wise, it's okay to not be okay. We have the Discord, we have the Gilded. My DMs are open on all social medias and in those. If you do need to reach out and talk about something or vent your frustrations or scream into the ether, I'm here. I'll listen. And if you need advice, I'll give it. I'm not a medical professional. And if it's beyond my, my means to help, I will always recommend a medical professional because it's not okay to uh, bottle it up. Okay? But as always, I'll see you in the next one, guys. Take care. Bye.